I'm going to school now, Mom. Wait, sweetie. You almost forgot your lunch. Thanks. Mom, your last kiss was Mr. Stevens? What about Dad? I'm sorry, sweetie. I know he's your principal. Please don't tell your father. Please. Bree, guess what? Sophie. No way. You had your first kiss? And it was Chad? Why didn't you tell me? I was going to. Wow, would you look at that? Your last kiss was Jake. Obviously, he is your boyfriend. Brianna, wait. Oh, hey, Chad. You look so beautiful today. I need to tell you, I've been in love with you since the second grade. Chad, you're Jake's best friend, and Sophie... You got something on the corner of your mouth. Let me get it for you. Okay. Chad, why did you just kiss me? I'm sorry, I... Now no one can touch me or they'll know we kissed! Bree! Are you running late to class, too? Hold my hand, babe. Let's work together. Stay back! Ew, Grandma! No, don't kiss her. Anyone who gets kissed by someone who isn't their soulmate gets a permanent kiss mark. I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. Look at that chubby little face. Hey! Wait a minute. That means I'm going to have this kiss mark on my face forever? Look at Brittany. She has so many kiss marks. Wow, that has to be at least 300 kiss marks. She is for the streets. You gotta be careful with who you let kiss you, because if too many people kiss you that aren't your soulmate, you'll end up like Brittany. Baby, I think we should have our first kiss today. Yeah, we should totally have our first kiss today, but uh, maybe later, because I didn't brush my teeth this morning. I have really bad morning breath. <gasps> Gross. What are you drinking? Pickle juice. It is so garlicky. You probably don't want to kiss me right now. I see what you're doing. If you didn't want to kiss me, you could have just said so. Jason, wait. Jason, I want to kiss you. I'm just scared. I don't want to get another kiss mark if you're not my soulmate. Brianna, I love you, and I truly believe that you're my soulmate. I'm willing to take the risk if you are. I am. Haha, <laughs> Brianna's stinky. Ewey. <laughs> no, no, guys, I'm not stinky. Yes, you are. No, it's not me, it's Steve. He's stinky. He is? Yeah, Steve is stinky. Let's all call him Stinky Steve for the rest of his life. Stinky Steve, Stinky Steve. Ha <laughs> ha. Here's your Christmas present, babe. Thank you, boy, for number one. Baby, here, I got you a Christmas present. And thank you, boy, for number two. Um, do you have two boyfriends? Yes. You can't have two boyfriends. That's cheating. What? Is it like the law or something? Hi, Jakey. Sup? Yo, Brittany, you look so beautiful today. <laughs> Did you just cut my hair? Oops, I thought I was holding a hairbrush. <laughs> hey, Brianna, we are putting a group project together. You need to help with the... Looks like you dropped your book, Stinky Steve. Go fetch. I'm so glad you're getting eliminated this year. Eliminated? This year, anyone who's not on the nice list by Christmas will be eliminated. What do you mean that everyone who's not on the nice list is going to be eliminated? Why would they do that? For population control and to get rid of all the mean people in the world, like you. Stinky Steve, don't walk away. I'm talking to you. What is it, Brianna? What can I do to get on the nice list? Stop being so rude, do good deeds, be kind, apologize to those you hurt, like me. Like you? I'm so sorry for whatever I did to you, you stinky, stinky Steve. It doesn't work. My nice percentage hasn't gone up at all. Because it's not genuine. You don't mean it. You don't even know what you did, do you? What did I do? You're the one who gave me the name Stinky Steve. Because of you, everyone calls me that. I don't have any friends, and I can't get a girlfriend because everyone thinks I'm stinky. One year, I almost failed all my classes because I stopped showing up at school. I couldn't bear being called Stinky Steve all day long. Steve, I really am sorry. It's too late to apologize. Steve? Steve, wait! Stinky, wait! I mean, Steve! That's it! Never talk to me again! I have a lot of people I need to apologize to, don't I? Boyfriend number one and boyfriend number two. I'm here to apologize to you guys and give back the Christmas gifts you gave to me. We have names, you know. It's the right thing to do, so... Okay, let go. Let go! You're forgiven, by the way. Honestly, we couldn't care less about you. We should actually be thanking you. Thanking me? Why? Because if it wasn't for you, we never would have met each other. Him and I are together now. We're in love. Brittany, I'm sorry I chopped off your hair earlier in class. I was just jealous because Jay complimented you and not me. You can have it back if you want. Why would you keep it? I was going to keep it in a jar in case I ever needed to clone you. What the? Principal Stevens, I need to make an announcement. No, you're not making an announcement. Attention everyone, this announcement is for Steve. I... Attention everyone, this announcement is for Steve. I am so sorry. You may all know him as Stinky Steve, but truthfully, he's not Stinky. I made up that name 10 years ago when I accidentally farted and it smelled really, really bad. So please stop calling him that. Steve, I 
really hope you can forgive me. I love you. Did you just say I love you? Yeah! Hey, Brianna, thanks for making that announcement. Steve. Did you really mean it when you said that you love me? No, I mean, unless you do. Maybe one day. Did you get on the nice list yet? How close are you? I just need 12% more. You should try doing some good deeds. That should get you on the nice list for sure. Got it. Boyfriend number one and boyfriend number two. What's this? Christmas gifts for you. Merry Christmas. Hey, I got you this last year. Here, Brittany. Um, what's this for? I'm giving money to the needy. I'm not the needy. I only need 1% more. Steve, I just need one more percent to get on the nice list. I'm at 49% nice. I'm sorry to tell you this, Brianna, but you need to be at 60% nice to get on the nice list. I guess I'm not as close as I thought I was. Hey, Brianna, don't worry. You can do this. Thanks, Steve. Ho, ho, ho. Wow, you're so close to being on the nice list. Uh, Santa Claus, what are you doing at my school? I've come to give you a very special gift. All the riches you could ever want are inside. These riches will be for you and you only. Wait, no, Santa, I can't accept this. I'm not a nice person. You should give it to someone who deserves it. Ho, 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 ho. That was a test. I tested you to see if you'd go back to your selfish ways and keep the riches all for yourself. But I'm a bad person. Someone who is truly bad would never believe that what they did was wrong. Steve, I made it on the nice list. That's great. I couldn't have done it without you. We make a good team. Whoa, uh, what are you doing? Mother! Good morning. How much energy did you get today? 10%. I won't even have enough to buy anything today. Oh no, that's so low. You won't have enough energy to walk to school. Don't worry, honey. I'll drive you to school today. Hey, Bree. Huh? Uh-oh, you sound like you don't have a lot of energy. No, I don't. I won't even have enough money to buy anything today. Can you buy me lunch? I won't need to. I discovered a trick. Here, use this. An iPhone charger? My dad works for the government, and I recently found out we all have secret charging ports, but you can't tell anyone about this, or else we'll be in big trouble. Where do I plug it in? Your belly button. Now remember, you shouldn't charge too much at once. It could be really bad. I won't. I just want to get to at least 300%. Too much energy at once isn't healthy. It could cause a malfunction. I'll be fine. Relax, Kayla. Perfect. I'm at 300% now. I feel great, Kayla. Kayla, 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 oh, Kayla, no, I Kayla, 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 Kayla. My energy's at 300% now. I feel great, Kayla, 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 oh, Kayla, no, Kayla, 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 Kayla. No, I'm not malfunctioning. I feel great, Kayla, Kayla, Kayla. Let's skip class and go to the mall. You sure you're okay? Mm-hmm. Hi, I'd like to purchase all of this. Is that everything? No. This too. I don't think you'll have enough. That will cost 100 energy. Oh, I have enough. Is everything okay, ma'am? Yeah, everything's fine. Ugh. My energy's getting a little low. How about we recharge and then do some more shopping? Good idea. You've been charging long enough. Just a little more. I want to get to 500%. No! Ouch! What was that for? Charging too much at once isn't safe. I told you I'll be fine. Brianna! Thank goodness, Brianna, you're all right. Mommy, why do I have a heart on my hand? Oh, you got it. That's your color-changing heart. When your heart is white, it means no one is currently in love with you. When your heart turns red, it means someone is in love with you. But if your heart turns black, it means their love for you is dead. Hey, baby. I got you this rose. It's beautiful. Just like you. Oh, would you look at that? My heart's still red. Someone's in love with me. Good morning, Bree. Hey, girl. Is everything okay with you and Derek? Yeah, why? Your heart turned black. Are you painting your heart red? Yeah, my boyfriend fell out of love with me, so I'm going to keep painting it red until he loves me again. If he was the one, he wouldn't have stopped loving you. Honey, are you home? Yeah, Mom, I'm home. How do you get red paint off your hand? Check your heart status. Maybe your heart's actually red. Honey, are you home? Yeah, Mom, I'm home. How do you get red paint off your hand? Check your heart status. Maybe your heart's actually red. By that reaction, your heart must be red. It was black earlier. That means Derek loves me again. How do you know it's Derek? Who else would it be? It has to be Derek. <laughs> Derek, you are so funny. Well, you know. Hi, Derek. Oh, hey, Brianna. I'm really busy right now. Can we talk later? Oh, okay.
Are you still painting your heart red? No. Derek loves me again. Wow, that was fast. Lucky you. Oh my gosh, my heart turned red. Do you think Derek loves you? I hope so. Brianna, your heart's red again. Looks like Derek does love you. No. I don't think it's Derek. I know who's in love with you. It's... Brianna, your heart's red again. Looks like Derek does love you. No. I don't think it's Derek. I know who it is. It's... Me. I'm sorry, but I don't think I feel the same way. Come on, give him a chance. Love doesn't always happen right away. Hey, baby, my heart's still black. We've been dating for a week and you still don't love me? You need to give it some time. We've only been dating for a week. Love doesn't always happen right away. But I do like you. I'll wait, as long as it takes. Hello? Hi, Brianna, this is James' mother. James is in the hospital now. He was in a tragic accident. He might not make it. I'm on my way. James, stay with me. Hello? My baby. Is James okay? Is he still breathing? He's gone, but his heart turned red. Because I love him. Good morning, Mom. I spy with my little eye my mom. Here, take your vision blocking glasses. I spy with my little eye these vision blocking glasses. Wear them as much as you can so you don't have to say I spy all the time. I barely take mine off. I spy with my little eye the ground. I spy with my little eye the bush. I spy with my little eye the bus. Class, can anyone tell me why the earth is flat? My eyes are so itchy. My glasses, where'd they go? Timmy, say I spy. I spy with... I spy with my little eye a beautiful girl named Brianna. Chad, is that you? Of course it's me. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I... I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. I spy with my little eye, Chad. Give me back my glasses. No way. I lost mine. Catch me if you can. I spy with my little eye, the wall. I spy with my little eye, Chad. I spy with my little eye, my vision blocking glasses. Hey, give them back. No, they're mine. And if you have your eyes open, you need to say I spy. I spy with my little... Chad? Chad? Attention everyone. For population control, you may no longer wear your vision blocking glasses or keep your eyes closed for an extended period of time. Anyone who breaks these rules will be killed. I spy with my little eye. trick-or-treating yeah can i be the one to knock okay trick, trick or, or treat, treat. <gasps> i got treats here you go thank you i got a trick what's on your shirt timmy i don't see anything made you all ha 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 he got you <laughs> yeah he really tricked me Timmy. hello trick or treat, trick or treat. Here's your candy. Thank you. I got a trick. That's okay. I'll give you a treat anyways. Thank you so much. Take a bite. Um, does this have peanuts in it? Of course. I'm severely allergic. <laughs> That's the trick. Eugene, now's not the time to sleep. We need to go do more trick-or-treating. Trick or treat. I got a trick? Someone needs to say to you, Happy Halloween before the timer runs out, or else also I stole all your candy. You mother One, two, three, four. Somebody's knocking at your door. Who's there? Who are you? How did you know that? Five, six, seven, eight. Answering the door will be a mistake. <gasps> Sweetie, did you already finish studying? Yeah, Mom, I'm done studying. I'm just heading to bed, okay? Just keep that door locked. Brianna? Yes, sir? I need you to come see me after class. We need to talk about your grades. Okay, yeah. You asked to see me, sir? Your grades have been declining exponentially. One, two, 
three, four. Somebody's coming to the door. Somebody's coming to the door. Excuse me? I need to lock that door! One, two, three, four. Somebody's coming to the door. Somebody's coming to the door. Excuse me? I need to lock that door! What are you doing? Someone's trying to get in. I'm going to open the door. No, 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 you can't. You don't understand. I understand. Now move out of my way. Five, six, seven, eight. Push him through the door before it's too late. <laughs> no, no, no. Let me in. Open the door. Let me in. Open the door. <laughs> One, two, three, four. It's safe now to go through the door. Brianna, have you seen our teacher, Mr. Stevens, anywhere? No, I haven't seen him anywhere. Huh, weird. One, two, three, four. Don't open the door. Don't open that door. Bro, but they're knocking. I love stealing Big Sissy's makeup. It's so much fun. Brianna, you did something wrong. You stole your Big Sister's makeup. Now you must make things right. You must right your wrong before the timer runs out or else you die. Live or die, the choice is up to you. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I stole your lipstick and I put it all over my face. It was a mistake and I really hope you forgive me. <laughs> I can't believe you took my lipstick again. What's wrong with you? You're such a little brat. Wait, don't worry about it, okay? I forgive you. I love you. I love you, sissy. Mommy, when's dinner ready? I cheated, I cheated on you. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to. What? Ah, daddy! Cover your eyes. <laughs> This is all your guys' fault. You kids are so bad, he wouldn't have found another woman. Or maybe you're just a terrible wife. Don't you? Guys, stop fighting. I just got a timer over my head. So did I. Maybe you're just a terrible wife. Don't you? Guys, stop fighting. I just got a timer over my head. So did I. Mom, I'm sorry. I didn't mean what I said. I only said it because I was mad at you. Yeah, okay, whatever, fine. I'm sorry too, okay? And I forgive you. Why is the timer still going off? I made my wrong right. I said sorry. You have to mean it, Mom. Okay, okay, I mean it. Come on, stop. Sissy, don't look. This is bull. Hey, any luck finding a job? Not yet. It's really been hard for me to take care of you on my own since Mom died. If we don't find a way to get money soon, you'll have to be put in foster care. I can't take care of you anymore. I'll find a job soon, okay? Hey, have a good day at school, okay? We'll figure this out. I love you. Oh, um, sir, sir, you dropped your wallet. Oh, how did I not notice? Thank you so much. No problem. Brianna, you did something wrong. It's time to right your wrong or face the consequences of your actions. Brianna, you did something wrong. It's time to right your wrong or face the consequences of your actions. Sir, sir, wait, sir. I stole money from your wallet before giving it back to you. I knew it was wrong and I'm so sorry I did that. I just couldn't help myself. I really need the money and I wasn't thinking. Thank you. It's very brave of you to own up to your actions. You're a good person. No, I'm not a good person. If there was no consequence to my action, I wouldn't have gave the money back. You are a good person because someone who is bad would never truly believe what they did was wrong. Here, take this. Consider it a gift. Sir, I can't accept this. I won't accept it back, so you might as well keep it. But I don't deserve it. Yes, you do. Have a good day. That voice. Wait! Where did he go? Hey, Professor, sorry I'm late. Your professor's not here. Today I'll be the one teaching the class. Brianna looks like she's seen a ghost. <laughs> now, Brittany. Brianna looks like she's seen a ghost. <laughs> now, Brittany. Making fun of someone is not a very nice thing to do. Apologize. Or face the consequences. The substitute teacher is the controller of right or wrong. What? Anyways, I guess I need to apologize. I'm so sorry that you're so easy to make fun of. Brittany, no, that's not an apology. Fine, I'm so sorry your face looks so silly when you're scared. No! Brittany! You're not going anywhere. You've got a lot of learning to do. Mmm, cookie. Can I see? Sure. Give me that. Timmy, give me my cookie back. Timmy, stealing someone's food without permission is not right. Make it right or die. Ah, okay, here. You already took a bite out of it. Hold out your hand. I can give it back. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. You keep it. 
Hello? Sissy, the control of right or wrong is in my classroom. Brianna's using her phone in class! Jimmy! You're so skibbity. You're so phantom tag. I just want to be your sigma. Be your sigma. Timmy, you can't copy what I just said. But I wanted that line. If you copy what someone just said or do an action that someone just did, you'll die. But I was supposed to sing that part of the song. <laughs> Great. And now Jimmy stole my line. Bye, Grandma. I'm off to school now. I'll see you later. What did you say? I couldn't hear you. I can't find my hearing aids. I'll see you later. You're an alligator. No, I'll see you later. You're stuck in a radiator? I'll see you later. Oh, I'll see you later. <laughs> Grandma! Guess what? I found your hearing aids. They were... Oh, no. Bree, what's up, girl? Oh, I'll, I'll get, get it. it. Which one of us went to go pick it up first? It was definitely me. Stop copying me. Stop copying me. I wasn't. Yes, you were. Look, both of us are still alive, so that means neither of us were copying each other. We both went to pick it up at the same time. Yeah, I guess you're right. Anyways, I'm heading to class now. Bye. Bye. So close. Hey, Brianna, did you finish the homework? I totally forgot. Yeah, I did. Chad, are you copying my homework? Um, no. Well, I really hope you're telling the truth because if you did just copy my homework, you're gonna die. I told you I did it. And that's why you should always do your homework. You tell him, Eugene. He can't hear you, he's dead. Good, now that everyone has their assignments, everyone must start their assignment at the exact same time so that no one is accused of copying someone else's actions. Three, two, one, begin. Oh, I'm getting so tired. Ooh! No, Brianna, don't yawn. I'd like to buy this granola bar. That'll be three slaps. What? But that's so expensive. Inflation's really bad right now. Do you want the granola bar or not? Yes, I want it. I'm so hungry. Hey, girl, want to go to the mall with me after school? I can't. The currency now is tears, and I have no tears left to cry. Man, you're broke. I have lots of tears. I've been saving mine in this jug for years. Oh, wow, you're rich. Please come with me to the mall. Maybe I'll be able to make you cry, and then you can buy things. Okay, I'll come, but why do you have this? I really want to buy this bag, but it's so expensive. It's ten tears. That's nothing. Let me try and make you cry. Okay. You're the disappointment in your family. That's why your dad never came back with the milk. No one in your life actually likes you. In fact, they find you annoying. People in your life only keep you around because they're bored, but the second someone better comes around, they ditch you in a heartbeat. Stop! I'm not going to stop until you have enough tears to buy the bag you want. The reason your boyfriend cheated on you is because you weren't a good enough girlfriend. On your birthday when none of your friends showed up because they said they were busy, they actually weren't busy. They just didn't want to come to your birthday. Also, your hair looks very, very dry. <laughs> the other day when you asked me if you'd ever be able to achieve your dreams, I said yes, but I really meant no. You're just not good enough. You're never going to achieve your dreams. <laughs> Look, Bree, you have more than enough tears. Lucky you. Lucky me. I'd like to buy this bag, please. All right, that'll be... No! All that work, and what did it get me? Do you still want the bag? Yes, I do, but I'm not sure what to trade for it. Well, first of all, I like those earrings. Okay, they're yours then. But that's not enough. How about your shoes, too? Shoes, all right. And your pants. Huh? So, Sophie, where should we go shopping next? Hmm, how about a makeup store? Yes! Day of the week is it? I forgot. <gasps> Oh no, Jimmy, you forgot! You need to remember before the timer runs out or else you die! I don't know, it could be any day of the week. It could be Monday, Tuesday, Friday... Come on, Jimmy, think! Come on, Jimmy! It's a day of the week that starts with a T. Oh, it starts with a T. Timmy? No, Jimmy, that's not a day of the week! Jimmy, no! The answer was Thursday. Wait... What did I just come in this room for? Oh no, I forgot! Are you off to school now, sweetie? <gasps> My school bag! That's what I forgot. Alright, Mom, I'm off to school now. You never said goodbye to me. Uh, uh, what's your name again? Grandma, you forgot? Grandma's getting old. She's becoming more forgetful. It starts with a B. Buddy! What? No, it rhymes with banana. Uh, it rhymes with banana. Uh, nana! Banana for fana, banana, banana. I don't know what else rhymes with banana.
Don't blame yourself. Grandma's memory has been getting bad for a while now. It's because of her old age. I'm leaving now. Bye, Mom. Aren't you forgetting something? What could I possibly be forgetting? Oh, my lunch. Jenny, your outfit looks so good. What's the occasion? Seriously, you forgot? No, I remember you're going to a funeral. No, you're my best friend. How could you forget? It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Jenny. I can't believe you. Jenny. Psst, Jenny. Jenny. Please forgive me. I'm sorry I forgot your birthday. Hey, Brianna, when Jimmy died, what day of the week was it? How could I remember that, Timmy? I was six. Hey, Brianna, when Jimmy died, what day of the week was it? How could I remember that, Timmy? I was six. <laughs> Come on, Brianna, think. The answer was Thursday. Thursday, Thursday, it was Thursday. Dang it. Timmy, why did you ask me that question knowing I wouldn't be able to remember? The day that Jimmy forgot, you had no remorse for him. Ever since then, I knew I had to get revenge. Timmy, what's the last thing you said to Jimmy? Oh, uh, uh, I don't remember. I'm lying. It was Jimmy no! From now on, Brianna, watch your back. I forgive you for forgetting my birthday. Really? No. What color shirt was I wearing yesterday? <laughs> Good job, Jenny. You guys are trying to get me out together. Your shirt was pink. You're right, it was pink. Hey, Jenny. When's my birthday? Your birthday was, um... Hey, Jenny. When's my birthday? Your birthday was, um... January? You got mad at me because I forgot your birthday. And even teamed up with Timmy to try and eliminate me. Leave me out of this. Brianna, I really am sorry. You've been a great friend. Come on, Jenny. You can remember. We've been friends in kindergarten. I, I can't. I just... I don't remember. No. <laughs> Jenny! Jenny! Well, this is awkward. <laughs> Jimmy! Ah, Mommy. This is all your fault, Timmy. You're the one who turned Jenny against me. Mom, can you come pick me up? What day of the week is it? Sunday. What did you eat for dinner last night? Raw onions. What's the last thing Jimmy said before he died? Oh, it starts with a T. Timmy! Brianna, are you trying to ask Timmy questions you know he'd forget? No. Uh, uh, it's not what it looks like. Did you forget my name? No, I remember your name, it's... I'm in love with you, Brianna. Did you forget my name? No, I remember your name, it's... I'm in love with you, Brianna. Of course, everyone forgets the nerdy guy's name. Eugene! I remember now, you're the nerdy guy who has no riz and gets no girls. That's enough, Brianna. Timmy, why did you say you're in love with me earlier? Because I am. I think that's the real reason I was so mad. What color shirt was I wearing yesterday? Blue. What did Eugene say to you after you remembered his name? That's enough, Brianna. I know you don't actually love me, Timmy. You were just trying to catch me off guard so I'd lose. Hey, Brianna. Jimmy, how are you alive? I took Jimmy to the hospital that night, and he survived. Jimmy's been in hiding ever since, because if the government found out, they'd eliminate him for real this time. Jimmy and Timmy, that night that Jimmy was so-called eliminated, what did I say before I walked off? That's a trick question. You didn't say anything. You just walked off. Yeah, she just walked off. That's correct. Why is the timer still going? No way. Is it not correct? I don't think so, Timmy. What she said was, it was Thursday. Oh, right. I remember now. You said it was Thursday. That's not the answer. If that's not the answer, what is? The answer was Thursday. It's your turn to play a game of truth or lie. Yay! Mommy, they said it's my turn to play a game. I love games so much. Sweetie, truth or lie is very dangerous. They'll give you a statement about someone you know, and you must say if it's a truth or a lie. And if you guess it wrong, you die. <coughs> Brianna, truth or lie? Your dad is coming back with the milk. Your dad is coming back with the milk. I think that is the truth because daddy said he would come back with the milk, so he must be coming back with the milk, right? Sweetie, I can't tell you the answer, but dad went to go get milk over a year ago now. Daddy's not coming back with the milk, is he? That's for you to decide. It was a lie. Bree! Sophie, hey! Truth or lie? Sophie makes fun of you for not having a dad behind your back. I just got a truth or lie. Sophie makes fun of you for not having a dad behind your back? You would never do that, right? Come on, Brianna, you know me. You can guess this right. Hey, Brianna, has your dad came home with the milk yet? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah,
जाचारे जाचारे पवन जाचारे पवन सन सन न न न सन सन न न न जाचारे जारे 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 पवन ब्रियाना आई लाइक यू यू चिमी Why did I just get money? Mommy, today at school when Timmy said he liked me, I got money. Honey, that's because every time someone has a crush on you, you get money. So you're saying I could be rich? Hey girl, do you want to go to the mall after school? I can't. I'm broke. How are you broke? Just go get boys to like you. I don't know how to get boys to like me. It's easy. Just do the bend and snap method. Bend and snap method? Drop something on the floor and go to pick it up. Hey boys. Don't talk to us. Oops. Whoa. I got it. Bro, I caught that on video. That bend and snap method of yours really works. I'm making bank. It's because of this. Look, the video the boys took of you went viral. <gasps> no way. Uh-oh, Brianna? Uh-oh, Brianna? There's a new video. You might want to see this. Oops. Whoa. I got it. He said it's giving boys the ick. When someone crushes on you, you get money. But if you give them the ick, you lose it. But it's not fair. I didn't fart. And I don't really look like that. No, I've almost lost all of my crushes. Does it say who posted that video? It was Jake. Jake. Hey, farty. Chad, where's Jake? I'm not telling you. Look, it's farty pin. Jake. Jake, take the video down. It's making me lose all my money and my crushes. I'm not taking the video down because I don't want you to have any crushes. Why not? Because I'm in love with you. Huh? <laughs> huh? Oh my. Someone made another edit of you. <laughs> huh? Oh my. Someone made another edit of you. It's Farty Pit. Jake. What the? Who even took that video? I took it. I saw you standing there so lovely, and I just couldn't help myself. Timmy, you still have a crush on me? Brianna, marry me, please. Just give me a chance. Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, are you all right? They were a little crazy. Yeah, I'm fine. Maybe having so many crushes isn't that great. Don't worry. I'll protect you. <laughs> Brianna, did you see that new edit of you? You must have lots of new crushes now. Yeah, I did. I have enough money to go with you to the mall after school now. Hey, Brianna, I really enjoyed spending time with you today. I really like you. Do you think maybe we could go on a date sometime? Jake, I've had a crush on you for years. But when you tried to destroy my image, that gave me the ick. Can you give me a foot massage? Oh, no. Grandma, I really wish I could, but I really gotta get to school. Oh, no. I am always on the dinner table, but you don't get to eat me. What am I? Grandma, you have three tries to guess it right, or else... This is an easy one. Feet! No, Grandma, your feet should never be on the table. My danger! No, Grandma, it's something you put food on. My hand! Thank goodness she's gone. She was giving me a headache. Grandpa! How could you say that about Grandma? I live in the ocean. I can live for a very long time. I'm a very large mammal. What am I? A large mammal? That's your grandma. Grandpa! <laughs> a dolphin? <coughs> a shark? <coughs> a whale? I got it. You sure it wasn't your grandma? <laughs> grandpa! I have two hands, but I cannot scratch myself. What am I? <laughs> your grandmother! I really like your new hairstyle, Brianna. Thank you, Jimmy. <coughs> Brianna! I really like your hairstyle, too. And thank you, Timmy. Timmy, don't copy me. Why do I keep getting money? I don't have a job. Because you just got compliments. Every time someone compliments you, you get money. So you're saying I could be rich? She's so cool. She's wearing sunglasses inside. Bro, two sunglasses? She's the coolest person on earth. Bro, hand sunglasses? 
Baby girl, you look so beautiful today. More money. Give me a kiss. No, I don't want you to ruin my lipstick. Yeah, I wouldn't want to ruin your perfect lip gloss. Tell me more. You're so beautiful. Your hair reminds me of straw. What's going on? Why am I losing money? I'm the most popular girl in the school. I get the most compliments. It's because everyone's insulting you. Look at this. Mom, dad, grandma, sissy. Why did no one wake me up for school? And where did all our furniture go? Bring back grandma or little sister? What do you mean bring back? I'm choosing little sister. Older sissy. Sissy, there you are. Where'd you go? I don't know. I was so scared. I was in a black dark room with no food or water. Bring back soda or water. I'm going to choose soda. I'm really craving one right now. Mmm. Sissy, why is the faucet pouring out soda instead of water? Oh, no. I think I know what this thing means. It gives me two options. And whatever I don't choose doesn't exist anymore. That means we have to shower with soda. Bring back mom or dad? You can't just choose one of them. We need them both. I choose. Here's your exam paper, Timmy. Um, miss, I forgot my pencil. Well, then I guess you'll just need to be prepared to <laughs> die. What? No, why? You could just, like, lend me a pencil and I can write my exam. Oh, Timmy, Timmy. Let me tell you a story of a boy who forgot his pencil. No pencil, no write exam. No write exam. Fail. Fail. No college. No college, no diploma. No diploma, no work. No work, no money. No money, no house, no food, no lab. But don't worry, just this once, I'll lend you a pencil. <laughs> Are you crying? No. Let me tell you a story about a boy who cried. He's touching me. I'm not touching you. Ah, you're touching me. Not touching. Brianna. That isn't something to joke about. If you touch an object or a person that doesn't belong to you, you'll die. Do you really think it means people too? It does. You can only touch someone if they agree they're yours and you agree you're theirs. But you must be careful because you can only belong to one person at one time. And if you touch someone who belongs to someone else, you die. You got that, Timmy? You need to survive this series, okay? Series? What? What? Hey, baby. Babe. You're mine, right? I'm all yours. Forever. What is my boyfriend doing over there? Babe, you're gonna be late. <laughs> For class. Brianna, what are you doing here? Sorry, Brianna, but he belongs to me now. He already agreed. He's not yours, Brittany! <laughs> no. No, Brittany! He's not yours, Brittany! No, no, Brittany! I'm so sorry, baby. Can I please just explain what happened? Come here! Don't touch me! I don't belong to you anymore! Brianna, I love you! <laughs> Did you complete your assignment? Yeah. Once I give you this assignment, it no longer belongs to me and belongs to you from now on. Thank you, and I have your test grid. As soon as I hand you your test back, as soon as your fingers touch the paper, it no longer belongs to me, it belongs to you. Thank you. Brianna, where's your boyfriend? Why isn't he in class today? He's not in class today because he's gone. What? How? He tried to touch me when I didn't belong to him anymore. Why? What happened between you two? He cheated on me. You deserve so much better than him. Class is over. Why did the door just shut? What are we gonna do? We can't open it. The door doesn't belong to any of us. I got it. Hey, Timmy, what am I doing? Bombastic side eye! Jinx, you owe me a soda! <laughs> Timmy! Poor Timmy, he wasn't fast enough. What happened? When you say something at the same time as someone else, the first person to say Jinx survives. If neither of you say it, you both live, but to be safe, I would say it. Good, Good morning. morning! Mom. I'm not going to say it. I know that neither of us would ever say that word to each other. Yeah, you're one of the only people I can trust that would never say that word to me. I love you, Mom. Have a good day. Morning, girl. Sophie, look at my new ring. Who got it for you? Jake. Jake. Uh, I'm not... Jinx! Why would you do that? I wasn't going to say the word. I just... I wasn't sure. Class, what's the answer to number three? 24. 24. Uh, 
Class, what's the answer to number three? 24. 24. Oh, jinx. Oh, why would you? <laughs> ah, Eugene, look what you did, Brianna. Class, I think it would be best if we all just go take a break for a few minutes. What's wrong with you? Why would you use that word? I was only going to say it because he was going to say it first. Yeah, sure he was. You're the worst, Brianna. <sighs> My boyfriend hasn't been answering his phone all day. Why are you looking extra handsome today, Jakey? Shh, not here. My girlfriend could be around. She's not here. I saw her. She went back to class. Good. Jake! Brianna, I, I can explain. Wait, it's, it's not, not what, what it looks, looks like. like. Jinx. That's what they all say. You men are so predictable. Oh, Jake, what have you done, Brianna? I didn't mean to do that. Oh, Jake, what have you done, Brianna? I didn't mean to do that. First Eugene and now Jake? Who's next? I didn't mean, mean to. to. Jinx. 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 I said it first. No, I definitely did. No. Jinx. Jinx. It's a tie. It's a tie. Okay, how about we agree that neither of us will say the word? Yeah. Jinx! Jinx! Another tie. Is this going to be a competition of who can say it first? I guess it is. Jinx! Jinx! You're never going to win, Brianna. Brianna. Brittany. You can go first. After, After you. you. Jinx! 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 Look at Brianna over there. She said the J word to her own boyfriend. No way. I saw it with my own two eyes. It never would have happened, Brittany, if you didn't kiss my boyfriend. Oh, honey, we were seeing each other for months behind your back. That's just the first time we got caught. Jinx. We were seeing each other for months behind your back. That's just the first time we got caught. Jinx. No! <laughs> no, Brittany, my baby! You were her boyfriend? I was. She was cheating on you, by the way. So was I. I'm looking for Brianna. She's right over there. I'm gonna need you to come with me. Uh-oh, someone's in trouble. Did I do something wrong, officer? We received an anonymous call from a student. They said you're making your jinx count go up on purpose. No, I would never. This is all just some terrible coincidence. Don't worry. We just want to ask, ask you, you some, some questions. questions. Jinx. Who are you? I'm Jimmy. Jimmy? Timmy's brother. I lost my brother when I was seven because of you. Bombastic side eye! Jinx, you owe me a soda! <laughs> I remember. Jimmy, listen. I didn't, didn't do, do it, it on, on purpose. purpose. Jimmy, listen. I didn't, didn't do it on purpose. J Jimmy, don't say it. I'm not going to say Jinx either. I feel bad about what happened to Timmy. You literally just said it! <laughs> I'm so sorry, Jimmy. Hey, kid, I know that you jinxed the other officer. I saw it all in the security footage. Stop, Stop right there. there. Jinx! Where do you think you're going? Let go of me! You stay right there. You're in big trouble, young, young lady. lady. Jinx, I knew you were going to say that. Hey, Mom, I'm coming home early. Sweetie, what have you done? The police are here looking for you. Mom, everything's gone out of hand. I kept talking at the same time as people, and then I said the J word because I was afraid, and then the officers came, and I said it on purpose because I was scared they were going to take me away. Jinx. Good, Good morning. morning. Mom. I'm not going to say it. I know that neither of us would ever say that word to each other. Goodbye, sweetie. Anna, promise me that when we're 18, we'll get married. Okay, I promise. Pinky promise? Pinky promise. No! You're never supposed to make a pinky promise! Because if you don't fulfill a pinky promise, you'll say bye-bye! Bye-bye, Timmy! No! From Earth! <laughs> Babe, would you ever cheat on me? Of course not! Promise me you'd never cheat on me. I promise. No, pinky promise. But pinky promises are dangerous! Fine, find a new girlfriend then. Wait, okay, fine, I pinky promise. <laughs> oh, what was that noise? It was Jake! Jake! What happened to him? He had to go. He didn't fulfill his promise to not cheat on his girlfriend. We literally just made that promise. He couldn't keep it for like two seconds? Brianna, it's almost time to fulfill our pinky promise. Timmy, no, there's got to be a way we can break our promise. How could we possibly break a pinky promise? We could make a pinky promise that overrides the current promise. And how would we do that? I pinky promise that when we're 18, we won't get married. I pinky promise. 
It didn't work. We can't just make a pinky promise to undo a pinky promise. I know. I pinky promise that when we're 18, we won't speak to each other or look at each other ever again. Okay, I pinky promise. Brianna, no! Now we have two pinky promises we have to fulfill! We could have just got married and got a divorce, but how are we even gonna get a divorce or even get married if we can't even look or talk to each other? You doomed us! All right, Timmy, I know what to do. Tonight I'm going to make a list of all of the ways we could break a pinky promise, and I'll bring it to you tomorrow. All right, I'm counting on you. You got the list? Yes. Ways to break a pinky promise. Well, what'd you write down? That's as far as I got. Are you guys trying to break a pinky promise? There's only one way to break a pinky promise, and that is to get rid of your pinkies. The deadly challenge for today is here. Oh no, we can only speak in jokes or else. That doesn't sound like a joke, Mom. Um, knock knock? Who's there? You need to laugh at my joke or else I'll get eliminated. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mom, want to know a funny joke? What's the joke? My life. <laughs> hey Brianna, are you all right? No, you are all left. <laughs> if no one finds your joke funny to me, you'll be eliminated. <laughs> all right, Timmy, you're safe for now. Class, you know why six was afraid of seven because seven, eight, nine. <laughs> <laughs> Brianna, what's the answer to number seven? Now, class, I'm not expecting a correct answer from her because remember, she is a blonde. <laughs> <laughs> I know the answer. What's funnier than 24? 25? <laughs> My dad makes better jokes than you. <laughs> For real, Jake, Brandon's not funny! Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Don't go to school. Don't go. Actually, I'm not going to school today. I feel sick. Hello? Brianna, are you okay? Are you somewhere safe? Yeah, I'm fine. I just didn't go to school today. Well, it's a good thing you didn't. There were masked intruders at her school. Some people didn't make it out safely. And the worst part is, the police haven't caught them yet. One second, Chad's calling. Hey baby, I miss seeing you today. Yeah, I missed you too, baby. Am I still coming over? No, don't let Chad come over. Chad, it's actually best if you don't come today. But I want to see you, I miss- <laughs> Hello? Help, help, let me in. Someone's chasing me. Please, don't let her in. Hello? Help, help, let me in. Someone's chasing me. Please, don't let her in. Hurry, they're chasing me. Who? Who's chasing you? I don't know, some crazy people wearing masks. Are they close? No, they're far away. Hurry. She's lying. Open up, they found me. You're coming with me. Ah, help! Help! Mom, where are you? When are you coming home? I'm 15 minutes away. I'm stuck in traffic. Tell her not to come. Don't let her come. Mom, you can't come home right now. Why not? You just can't. Just don't come. Hey, baby. How are you feeling? Chad, how did you get in here? Your window was open. Be careful. Oops, I dropped my... I'll get it. Chad... Why do you have a mask? Because you're next. I can't wear these anymore. You have to smile or I'm going to put the clothing pins back on, okay? Okay. Honey, you know I'm doing this because I love you, right? If you get caught not smiling, you'll be executed. Yeah. Me sissy walking. Ah! You made me fall. Oh, sorry, sissy. <laughs> I think I broke my leg. Sissy. <laughs> You're not smiling. We have a code red. Hurry. Smile. You look so beautiful when you smile, babe. Well, that's good because that's all we're allowed to do, so... My mother was just executed. Baby, you're not smiling. Smile. I can't believe she's gone. Baby, they're watching. Hurry up, smile. Baby, smile. We've got a code red. Baby, they're watching. Hurry up. Smile. <coughs> Baby, smile. We've got a code red. Okay, okay, I'm smiling, I'm smiling. Your smile's looking a little low today. Yeah, it is. We're going to have to use the clothing pins again. You need a much wider smile than that. Hey, Bree. Hey, Bestie, your smile's looking a little low. Here. Try these clothing pins. It's a trick my mom taught me. You put it right here. 
What's even the point anymore? Bessie, you need to smile. I can't lose you too. We've got a code red. I'm smiling. I'm smiling. We'll let you off with a warning. A warning? They never got a warning. I'm smiling. I'm smiling. We'll let you off with a warning. A warning? They never got a warning. My boyfriend, my best friend, my five-year-old sister. Your mother would be very upset you're acting this way. My mother? Yeah, the creator of the Smiling Law. She told us to show no mercy to her children, but I figured she'd be upset if both her daughters were gone. Mother. Where's your smile? You're the creator of the Smiling Law. Is that a problem, honey? Think of all the people that died because of you. Little sister, she was only five years old. And she didn't obey the law, and neither did you. Where are the police? You're a monster. Looks like I'm going to have to get rid of you myself. Come on, honey. You've already lost everyone. You really want to lose your mother, too? You're the only one I wanted to lose. Hi, I'm Brianna, and today I'm going to be making a candy salad with all my friends. I brought the Sour Patch. My name is Miss Applewood, and I brought the mint. No, Miss Applewood. You were supposed to bring a sweet candy, not a minty one. I gotta sneeze. No! Hey, I'm Timmy, and I brought the mamba. Hi, I'm Eugene, and I brought the nerves. Hi, my name's Brittany, and I brought the sweet tarts because I am just so sweet. What's up, everyone? I'm Jake, and I brought the sour, chewy nerd. Bon appetit! Uh, I think I lost my dentures in there! Mommy, did you win us any food today? No, I lost again, darling. I'll have to try again tomorrow. But, Mommy, I'm starving. We haven't eaten in days. What about Sissy? Did she play? I did, but I lost. Unfortunately, we can only play once a day. I can play. No, you can't. You're too young. I'm old enough. I can play in the Hunger Games. Let her try and win some food. I'll come with her. Okay, you can go. I know you're very hungry. You can try and win us all some food. But be careful. People are very hostile when they're hungry. I'm here to play a game for food. Welcome. You'll be playing against Miss Turner. Listen here, little brat. I got family to feed. I'm not losing. Miss Turner, you better watch yourself. The game you will be playing is Rock, Paper, Scissors. Begin. Rock, Rock paper, paper, Scissors. I chose paper. Scissors beats paper. Here's your food. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. you guys. I got ten bits to feed. You guys. I got ten bits to feed. Miss Turner, that is not your food to touch. <laughs> Sissy, close your eyes. Here, give me the food. I'll hold it for you. you sissy. Don't touch food that doesn't belong to you. <gasps> Why would you do that? That was my sister. I'm here to play a game for food. Your opponent is Derek. The game is Simon Says. Simon Says, touch your head. Derek, be quiet. I can't hear him. Touch your... Derek! No, 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 no. He didn't say Simon Says. Derek is the winner. Yes. You cheated, Derek. Now I can't eat today. Did you win your game today? I lost. They made a new rule that you can play for food more than once a day. But if you lose your second try, you die. Please promise me you won't play more than once a day. Yeah, Mom. I promise. Brianna? Timmy? Did you win any food today? I lost. I lost my game too. How about you and I play again and face each other in the Hungry Games? I'm in. <laughs> oh no, she only has one brain cell today. That's not enough. How is she going to survive? <laughs> Here, honey, eat this. It's breakfast. Cut. She can't go through the day with only one brain cell. I know what to do. I was gifted a special chocolate that increases brain cells. Honey, eat this right away. Kitchen. No, sweetie, that's chocolate. You need to eat it. So close, sweetie, but a bit lower. Yes. And take a bite. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. I just read that entire book in three seconds. Honey, she has infinite brain cells. All right, guardians, I'm off to school. No need to walk me. I know the way. Class, what's three plus two? The answer's five, miss. What is this, baby class? Are we in baby school? This is kindergarten, but you're too smart for kindergarten. You'll have to go to high school. <laughs> I am fed up, okay? I quit. I am sick of slime, all right? I tried to make slime again.
Wanna know how it went? Not good. Brianna, zero. Slime, two. Look, I spilled, first of all, I spilled glue all over my shirt, or slime, or whatever, all over my shirt, all over my pants, and then it still didn't even turn out well. I'll show you guys. Also, it's all over my floor. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's like better than last time, but it's so sticky. I don't know, man. Look, guys, I did it. This is what you wanted, right? You always do it. I feel these slime videos. This is what you want. This is what you want from me. <laughs> oh my goodness. I have so much to clean up. Do this. Put your hands on your head. Wait, did she say do this or do that? Yes, she said do this. Hurry, everyone put your hands on your head. <laughs> Sophie was too slow. Do this. Blink your eyes three times. Do that. Remove your hands from your head. Finally. Timmy, no, she didn't say do this. Please, give me another chance. <laughs> do that. Touch your nose. No one do it. She said do that and not do this. Good listening, Brianna. My arm's getting so sore. I don't know how much longer I can hold it up for. I can't hold up my arms anymore. I'm putting them down. No, no, you can't. If you put your arms down, she'll kill you. I have to. Ugh, much better. Do this. Take your hands off your head. <sighs> Finally, my arms are so sore. Do this. Don't breathe. <gasps> Do this. Don't breathe. <gasps> I'm asthmatic. I need my inhaler. Do that. Breathe. Do this. Breathe. <sighs> Thank goodness she let us breathe. I was about to pass out. I need to use the washroom. Hurry before she tells us to do something. Do this. Stand still. Guess you can't use the bathroom. I already did. I'm so hungry. Can this game stop so I can eat something? Do this. Pick up a slice of pizza. Mmm, pizza. No, she didn't say to eat it. Please let us eat the pizza. I'm so hungry. If I don't eat something soon, I'm going to pass out. Do this. Finish the slice of pizza before the timer runs out. Do this. Finish the slice of pizza before the timer runs out. I finished my slice already. You got this, Brie. Last bite. Brianna, hurry. Swallow. The timer's almost out. Safe. Brianna, you did it. Thanks for encouraging me there, Jake. I was almost ready to give up. Do this. Kiss someone. I guess we should kiss? I mean, I guess we have to. Well, that wasn't so bad. Do this. Grab a water bottle. Do that. Drink from the water bottle. Wait, I'm so thirsty. Jake, no, she didn't say do this. She said do that. Goodbye, Brie. I love you. <laughs> do this. Kill someone. Do this. Don't kill anyone. The rules never said we couldn't play. Do this. Kill someone. Do this. Don't kill anyone. The rules never said we couldn't play. Brianna, don't tell her what to do. She might get angry. Do this. Kill Brianna. Do this. Don't kill Brianna. I said do this. Kill Brianna. Do this. Don't kill Brianna. Do this. Everyone, go drink water, eat food, and go to the washroom if you have to. Do this. Don't go anywhere. Brianna, what you're doing is very dangerous. Do that. Drink from your water bottle. Finally, she's letting us drink. Don't do it. She said do that, not do this. Do this. Everyone, go and drink water and stop playing do this, do that. Do this. Stand still and keep playing do this, do that. Do this. Everyone, go and drink water and stop playing do this, do that. Do this. Continue playing do this, do that. Do this. Everyone. Do this, Brianna. Never participate in playing do this, do that again. I'm free. 
I'm free! I'm going to school now. Come if you want, sissy. If not, I don't care. Just wait a minute. Ugh! Ouchie! Get up yourself. Spare change, spare change. If only you lived in a world where people could be kind. Hey! Sissy, that was really unnecessary. Are you okay, sir? I love you, sissy. I love you, sissy. Hey, you dropped your pen. Oh, uh, I mean, I don't care. Pick it up if you want. Doesn't bother me. Here's your test back that I'm only giving to you because I'm obligated to. Thank Thank goodness! Talk you long enough! Are you doing okay? I know you're upset about your sister. How do you... Hey, if you want to act kind and get killed, go right ahead. Just leave me out of it. I can't get killed because I'm already dead. I know how to put an end to this kindness law. I know how to put an end to this kindness law. All you have to do is kill them with kindness. If I act kind, I'll die. You have to kill them with kindness before they kill you. Kindness will only kill those who are evil. That's why they made the law in the first place. So that the evil could continue living. Brianna, why are you staring so intensely at nothing? Just mind your business, Timmy. Let's go to class. Timmy, you're really handsome. What are you, dumb or crazy? Why are you saying kind things? Brianna's eliminated. Over. I like your shoes, scary guy. I think the way that you eliminate people is just so cool and amazing. Stop talking. Uh, why can't I move? What's going on? Are you okay? Did you need help with anything? I'm here to help if you need me. I can't move! Brianna, what just happened? We need to get out of here, Timmy. Come on! Brianna, what was that? I know how to put an end to the kindness law. We can live in a world that is kind. We all just- What makes you think a world with kindness is better than this one? Personally, I prefer evil. Timmy. Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Here, you should take your umbrella. It's raining cats and dogs outside. Come on, Mom. It can't be that bad. On second thought, I'll take that umbrella. For the class project, you'll be partnered with Steve. Who's Steve? I never met him. We've literally been in the same class for years. Hi, Steve. Meeting someone for the first time can be awkward. Do you mind if I break the ice? Go ahead. Great. What did you get on the test, Brianna? An A, obviously. <laughs> liar, liar, pants on fire. Ah! Ah, my pants! My pants on fire! My pants on fire! How much for this granola bar? They're not cheap. It'll cost you an arm and a leg. Are you serious right now? That's so expensive. Don't blame me. Blame inflation. It's just an arm, okay? All right. I guess that's fine. Oh no, it's a serial killer! Ah! Guys, relax, it's just cereal. Ah! Mommy, it's almost the new year. Forget mommy or daddy? No, no, I can't choose. Sweetie, you have to choose before it's the new year, or else you'll forget us both. Five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year, Mom. Mommy, Happy New Year! Who are you, little girl? Why are you talking to me? I'm your daughter. I don't have a six-year-old. I only have one daughter, and she's 15 years old. Mommy! Oh, no, darling. I think your mother chose to forget you. Who are you? Get away from me, weirdo! That's it. I'm going to get milk. It's that time of year again, Mom. What time of year? Where we choose who we will forget in the new year. Oh, it's that time again? What are your first options? Remember when you chose to forget me when I was six? That was so long ago. You were six years old. We barely had any memories to begin with. But I know you now. I choose. I choose. What were your options? You never told me, sweetie. It was between older sister and grandma. I chose grandma. Good choice. Grandma's old anyways. Yeah. Girl, your fit is so cute. Thank you, bestie. Now, how does my girlfriend get more beautiful every single day? Stop it, babe. What's wrong, Bree? I just got my next set of options. No, no, I'm not going to choose. Brianna, you have to choose because if you don't choose before it gives you the next set of options, you'll forget them both. Who in the new year are you going to forget? It was between Timmy or Jimmy. I chose Jimmy. That's a good choice. Everyone likes Timmy better. I wish my girlfriend was as pretty as you. So leave her and be with me. Don't worry, I will soon. I made the wrong choice. I'm not gonna choose. 
I want to forget them both. Oh, babe, you're here. I'm not your babe. Not anymore. Got your pen? Jimmy! Jimmy, catch! Jimmy! Catch, Jimmy! Come on, guys, give me my pen back. Forget Timmy or Jimmy. Hmm. Choose Jimmy! What? No, don't choose me. Timmy's the one who stole your pen in the first place. I'm gonna choose... Jimmy. Jimmy! I thought you said you got them as an option earlier, Brianna. Why'd you lie to me? Uh, you know what? Don't even tell me. Bestie, wait! Sophie, let me explain. Why didn't you tell me who you actually chose to forget? I didn't tell you because... I chose to forget you over my boyfriend. Oh, I just got an option. Choose to forget you or choose to forget Emma. I choose. I choose. Bessie, please don't choose to forget me. And why not? You chose to forget me. I know when it was a mistake, but you and Emma aren't even that close. If you choose to forget me, then neither of us will ever remember our memories together. And we won't ever meet again. Why would I want to remember someone who chose a boy over their best friend? <laughs> Emma would never do what you did. Goodbye, Brianna. It's one more day till the new year. Almost everyone I care about is going to be forgotten. Forget my cat Oreo or my older sister? No, no, I can't choose. No, I have to choose. I don't want to forget them both. It disappeared. I'm going to forget both of them? 15 seconds until the new year. New year, new me. Forget myself or everyone I've ever known? Brianna, it's almost a new year. Hurry and choose. I got 110 happiness today. I'm so happy. Maybe a little too much. How much did you get? 1%. That's even more than yesterday. That's so sad. It's going to be my life goal from now on to get you more happiness. What makes you happy? Pain and suffering. No. I'd like to buy this granola bar. That'll be 3% happiness. Dang it. I don't have enough. I really need to get more happiness. Well, that's too bad. Why is there a bunch of men over there with six packs? Where? Hey, you need to pay for that! Hey, Brittany, you said you'd help me get more happiness? I'm down. I'm tired of being broke. Yay! I'm so excited! Brianna, I figured out what will make you more happy. If you got a boyfriend, I found a man who's willing to go on a date with you. Hi, I'm Timmy. <laughs> what? 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 What the? Brianna, no, you're supposed to flirt with Timmy. I was flirting. I'm not going on a date with her. She is scary. Come on, Timmy. Try. At least sit with her at lunch or something. Fine. Why is she looking at me like that? I'm so scared right now. Brianna, you're not supposed to stare creepily at your date. How about you put these sunglasses on so you don't scare him to death? Fine. This isn't better. Timmy, 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 Timmy. <laughs> Brianna, this isn't how you flirt. That's it. Brittany, I don't care how much money you're paying me to go on a date with her. She's weird. I'm leaving. You paid him to go on a date with me? I did, but Brianna, just let me explain. Are you okay? No. Honestly, I don't even care. You're just in my sulking spot. What song are you listening to? You probably don't know him. He's a really underground artist. <laughs> no way. That's my favorite song. You're so cool. Can I get your number? Sure. I'm Spike. I'm Brianna. Mommy, I think there's something in my hair. An egg! I'm... No, don't eat that. That's your soulmate Easter egg. Soulmate egg? Open it. Inside will be a letter of your soulmate's name. Why? Look at you. You got one letter already. Each Easter egg will have a letter of your soulmate's name, and once you complete the name, you'll meet your soulmate. Now, it can be difficult to know where to look for your soulmate Easter egg, so you'll be given hints on where to find them. But mommy, what if I found an egg and it's on my soulmate egg? Somebody else's soulmate egg. Don't worry, sweetie. You'll only be able to find the eggs that are meant for you. Okay, mommy. I'm going to look for my soulmate, but not yet. I'm only six years old. I'll start searching when I'm a big girl. That's a good idea. Good morning, sissy. This is the year I'm going to find my soulmate, little sissy. All I have to do is find all these Easter eggs before Easter. Oh, no. Where are they? I'm in a container with items that look like me, but aren't me. What? what? I'm in a container with items that look like me, but aren't me. What could that possibly mean? My tummy's upset. Those eggs that Mama fed us this morning were gross. An egg container! Harry, open it, open it! And I was right. Finding my soulmate is going to be so easy. I only need three more letters. What letter did you get? 
a.m. <gasps> oh, no, sissy. It's 7.55 a.m. We're going to be late for school. Oh, no. Just do it. Oh, thank goodness you're not in class yet, Timmy. That means I'm not late. You're definitely late. I'm skipping class. Oh, no. You'll find me where you're standing right now. My shoes! There's no eggs in there. Check your school bag. Maybe it's in your hair. Maybe it's in your clothes. Your ears? In your nose? Wait! I think I know where it is. The hint says you'll find me where you're standing right now. So it must be underneath me. Where? In the floorboards. Wait, you can't just... I found it. You can't just rip apart the floor like that. I. Blank I blank M Y. It's you. Huh? You're my soulmate. It can't be me. I have a girlfriend who I love. How many letters does your soulmate have? Seven. Timmy, it must be you then. You must be my soulmate. No, I told you it's not me. Timmy, come back. Timmy. Hey, Brianna, why weren't you in science class earlier? Who cares about class? I'm trying to find my soulmate. You're searching for your soulmate? What a waste of time. The person in front of you has it? Why are you looking at me like that? You have my soulmate egg. No, uh Just give me the soulmate egg, Jimmy. And we're not gonna have a single problem. I don't have it. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Jimmy? Ah. Jimmy? Why does everyone keep running from me today? Oh, no. Jimmy! Stay back! Jimmy, my hint says that you have my soulmate egg. So just hand it over so that I can finish my soulmate Sam and be with my soulmate the rest of my life and get married and have babies. I told you already, I don't have any soulmate eggs. The only eggs I have are the boiled eggs in my lunchbox. Can I have a look inside that box? No, you can't. Jimmy, do you like chocolate eggs? Yeah, I do actually. Would you like to have them? Sure thing. I'll give you these delicious, yummy chocolate eggs. If you let me look inside your lunchbox. Okay, fine. Have a look. See, there's nothing in there but hard-boiled eggs. Wait. What is it? There's an imposter. No way. How did I not notice? What letter does it say? It says M. So, why do you look so shocked? Because, Jimmy, you might be my soulmate. My soulmate's name says blank I-M-M-Y. The missing letter could be J. There's no way you're my soulmate. You're not my type. I gotta go. Jimmy! Jimmy! Why does everyone always run away from me when they find out that they might be my soulmate? Is being my soulmate really that bad? <laughs> Hurry up and catch me, but I might run away from you? It must be somewhere where people are either playing catch or running. Where would someone be playing catch or running? Gym class! Sophie, catch! Got it! Everyone's playing catch in here. Hey, what are you doing here? You're not in this gym class. Sorry, sir. I'm just looking for something. I'll leave in one minute. No, you're gonna leave now. Eugene, ready to catch? That's my soulmate egg! Jake, wait! Throw it here! Um, no. The principal's on his way. You're gonna be in big trouble. Jake, please! Eugene, catch! Ow! You're not supposed to aim Ooh. for my face! Oopsies! Hurry, Eugene! Throw it back to me! Eugene, throw it to me! Why would I throw it to you? You're not my gym partner. Do you really want to throw it back to the person that threw it at your face? That's true. Catch! <sighs> yes! The principal's here to speak with you. Ah! Finally, I found the last soulmate egg. Now it's time to reveal who my soulmate is. Got your soulmate egg! Jimmy! Timmy! Catch Jimmy! Catch Jimmy! Guys, please stop. Just give me my soulmate egg. I've worked so hard to find no, it. No, I won't give it to you because your soulmate's either me or Jimmy, and we don't want to be your soulmate. Don't worry. I'm pretty sure that neither of you are my soulmate. And why not? Because my soulmate would actually want to be with me. Please, give it back. I need to know. Fine. Here you go. Please don't be a T or a J. K. The name's Kimmy. Hey, no way. Kimmy's my sister's name. Wait a minute. A potato, pass it on. I don't want this potato. It's ugly. You have to pass it on before the timer runs out or else you die. <gasps> Hello, little girl. Sure, random guy. Have a potato. Thank you. I am so hungry. <laughs> Hot potato, pass it on. Seriously, Derek. <sighs> Where is everyone? Sophie, hot potato, pass it on. Why would you give me the potato? I'm your best friend. Timmy, hot potato, pass it on. Are you kidding me right now? I'm glad you're safe, Sophie. Yeah, no thanks to you. How could you pass me the potato? I thought we were best friends. 
I was scared. I couldn't find anyone else to pass it to. We're not best friends anymore. Don't talk to me ever again. Sophie, don't do this. Goodbye. Sophie! Oh, no. Oh, no. <gasps> Everyone run! She has the potato! Come on, guys! Jimmy, hot potato, pass it on! Oh! Whoa, 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 I'm gonna drop it! No, Jimmy, if you drop the potato after touching it, you die! I dropped it! Come on, Jimmy! Hey, Sophie, wait. Are you really just never going to speak to me again? Hot potato, pass it on. Hot potato, pass it on! Hot potato, pass it on! No, you pass it on! No, you! No, you! Pass on the potato! Hot potato, pass it on! Pass on the hot potato! Pass it on, Sophie! Pass it on! Ouch! This assignment's so hard. Could you help me, Brianna? <laughs> Anything for you, Jake. Oh, mother f Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Here, you should take your umbrella. It's raining cats and dogs outside. Come on, Mom. It can't be that bad. On second thought, I'll take that umbrella. For the class project, you'll be partnered with Steve. Who's Steve? I never met him. We've literally been in the same class for years. Hi, Steve. Meeting someone for the first time can be awkward. Do you mind if I break the ice? Go ahead. Great. What did you get on the test, Brianna? An A, obviously. <laughs> liar, liar, pants on fire. Ah! Ah, my pants! My pants on fire! My pants on fire! How much for this granola bar? They're not cheap. It'll cost you an arm and a leg. Are you serious right now? That's so expensive. Don't blame me. Blame inflation. It's just an arm, okay? All right. I guess that's fine. Oh, no. It's a serial killer. Ah! Guys, relax. It's just cereal. Ah! Hey, Brianna. Are you ready for the test today? No, I didn't study. Then you really should hit the books. Yeah. <gasps> you may begin writing your test. Stephanie, I'm really worried about this test. Don't worry, Bri. It's a piece of cake. Oh, it's a piece of cake. <laughs> Stephanie, you're not going to believe what I just found out about Timmy. Come on, spill the tea. There was no tea wasted in the making of this video. Brianna, you told Stephanie my secret? Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to lose your marbles. And you lost your marbles, Timmy. Here's your test back. <gasps> I got a 70%. I got 100. Careful, you're turning green with envy. I'm not envious. You're green. Last words. I hate... Honey, no, you can't say those words. If you say those words to someone, it'll be the last words that they hear. Ever. Ah! Okay, Mommy, I won't say it. Mommy, what are your last words? I can't tell you because if I say those words, you won't hear another word ever again. I hate... No, what are you doing? <laughs> I was just kidding, Mommy. <laughs> I can't have... Ah! Sweetie, what are you doing? I'm getting ready to go out with my friends, Mom. No, I'm sorry, but you can't go out tonight. It's a school night. Plus, you have to stay home and watch your little sister. Why do I have to take care of little sissy? Can't you call babysitter for once? I never get to go out with my friends. Babysitters are too expensive. I'm working two jobs just to get by. Please understand. No, Mom, it's not fair. All of my friends get to go out, like, every day. Well, you're not all your friends. I have to get to work now. I'm running late. I love you. I hate you! Oh, no. What happened to mommy? Did you do that? I did, but you need to understand it was an accident. I accidentally said my last words to her. <sighs> mommy! Shh! You can't tell anyone about this, sissy, or you'll go to foster care and you'll never ever see me again. Got it? Okay, okay, I won't tell anyone. Sissy, come on, it's time for school now. Okay, I'm ready. Sissy, remember. Shh. You're not going to say anything about what happened to mom, right? I told you, I won't say it. Where did you put mommy anyways? She's in her bed. It's just like she's sleeping. Yeah, except she's not sleeping. Babe, I got you flowers. Thank you. I cheated on you. What? It happened last night. I just couldn't control myself, but don't worry. She meant nothing. You're the one I love. I hate you. Oh, no. Excuse me. I'm going to need to ask you a few questions. Why, officer? Your little sister mentioned to her teacher that something happened to your mother. All right, so I'm just going to check your heartbeat. Ah! What's wrong? Ah! Your heart's not beating. Your heart's not beating. No! 
Sorry about that. I was holding it backwards. Relax. You're in hands. Don't you mean I'm in good hands? No. That's not where my heart is. Oh, <laughs> my bad. I get my left and right mixed up all the time. This side. Okay. Next, we're just going to check your blood pressure. All right, relax. Relax. Breathe. Stop breathing. Breathe. Don't breathe. Why aren't you breathing? Breathe! <sighs> So your blood pressure is very high. Have you been stressed recently? I wasn't until I came in here. Mm, okay, so it's recent. Don't write that down. Good morning. Mom, I have like 10 sweaters on. Why is the house freezing cold? The government released a temperature meter to help you find your soulmate. The hotter it is, the closer you are to your soulmate, and the colder it is, the farther away you are from your soulmate. Where is my soulmate? The moon? It's finally starting to warm up a bit. Not for me, brr. I'm even colder than I was this morning. I feel heat coming from that way. You should follow it then. It will lead you to your soulmate. I need to go towards the heat. I've been freezing all morning long. It's getting warmer. Follow the heat. What are you doing? I'm following the heat. Oh, it's getting hot. This door, it's like it's on fire. That's where my soulmate must be. Oh my gosh. Why is it so hot in here? Excuse me, are you in the right classroom? What are you doing here? My soulmate's in this classroom. But I gotta go. It is way too hot in here. Ah! Oh my gosh, it's finally cooling down. It's so nice and cool over here, bestie. Says you, I've been freezing all morning. So, did you find your soulmate? No, I found out which classroom my soulmate's in, but I couldn't get close. I started overheating. How am I supposed to find my soulmate if it gets unbearably hot every time we get close? Only at first. You two need to introduce yourselves to each other. Once you introduce yourselves to each other, the temperature will become perfect. Why does no one tell me these things? Why is it getting so hot? You're so hot. It's getting so cold all of a sudden. Is your soulmate still breathing? If he's not alive, you'll freeze to death. Wake up! Oh. Hurry, Bree. Introduce yourself to your soulmate. Hi, my name is Brianna. Hello? Hello? I'm still freezing. That's because he also needs to introduce himself to you. Is he still breathing? He's breathing, but he's not responding. He needs to go to a hospital. Now. Yeah. Well, doctor, is my soulmate going to be okay? It's not looking good right now. It appears he's had a heart attack. Oh, no. He must have had a heart attack when he saw me because I'm so beautiful. No, he has a history of heart problems. Please wake up. I want to meet you. I have some unfortunate news. We believe this man may be brain dead. He won't be able to communicate and his organs will start to fail. No, doctor. If he goes, I'm going to freeze. We aren't 100% sure, but we're going to run some tests to confirm it. Please introduce yourself to me. I'm going to freeze. Hi, I'm Timmy. I love you. I am fed up, okay? I quit. I am sick of slime, all right? I tried to make slime again. Wanna know how it went? Not good. Brianna, zero. Slime, two. Look, I spilled, first of all, I spilled glue all over my shirt, or slime, or whatever, all over my shirt, all over my pants, and then it still didn't even turn out well. I'll show you guys. Also, it's all over my floor. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's like better than last time, but it's so sticky. I don't know, man. Look. Guys, I did it. This is what you wanted, right? You always do it. I feel these slime videos. This is what you want. This is what you want from me. <laughs> oh my goodness. I have so much to clean up. Mommy, it's almost the new year. Forget mommy or daddy. No, no, I can't choose. Sweetie, you have to choose before it's the new year, or else you'll forget us both. Five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year, Mom. Mommy, Happy New Year. Who are you, little girl? Why are you talking to me? I'm your daughter. I don't have a six-year-old. I only have one daughter, and she's 15 years old. Mommy! Oh, no, darling. I think your mother chose to forget you. Who are you? Get away from me, weirdo! That's it. I'm going to get milk. It's that time of year again, Mom. What time of year? Where we choose who we will forget in the new year. Oh, it's that time again? What are your first options? Remember when you chose to forget me when I was six? That was so long ago. You were six years old. We barely had any memories to begin with. But I know you now. I choose. I choose. What were your options? You never told me, sweetie. It was between older sister and grandma. 
I chose Grandma. Good choice. Grandma's old anyways. Yeah. Girl, your fit is so cute. Thank you, bestie. Now, how does my girlfriend get more beautiful every single day? Stop it, babe. What's wrong, Bree? I just got my next set of options. No, no, I'm not gonna choose. Brianna, you have to choose because if you don't choose before it gives you the next set of options, you'll forget them both. Who in the new year are you going to forget? It was between Timmy or Jimmy. I chose Jimmy. That's a good choice. Everyone likes Timmy better. I wish my girlfriend was as pretty as you. So leave her and be with me. Don't worry, I will soon. I made the wrong choice. I'm not gonna choose. I wanna forget them both. Oh, babe, you're here. I'm not your babe. Not anymore. Got your pen. Jimmy! Jimmy, catch! Jimmy! Catch, Jimmy! Come on, guys, give me my pen back. Forget Timmy or Jimmy. Hmm. Choose Jimmy! What? No, don't choose me. Timmy's the one who stole your pen in the first place. I'm gonna choose Jimmy. I thought you said you got them as an option earlier, Brianna. Why'd you lie to me? Uh, you know what? Don't even tell me. Bestie, wait! Sophie, let me explain. Why didn't you tell me who you actually chose to forget? I didn't tell you because I chose to forget you over my boyfriend. Oh, I just got an option. Choose to forget you or choose to forget Emma. I choose. Class, I got a note from your substitute teacher. And it says that you kids were bad. While well, I was away yesterday. Never in all my 50 years of teaching have I met students who are so mean and bad. You are the worst people on the planet. Everyone, put your heads on your desk and don't speak. Um, miss? No speaking. <sighs> or breathing. Class, now who knows the answer to this equation? Yes, I see lots of hands, but you, Timmy in the back, who clearly doesn't want to answer the question. Yes, you. What's the answer? Uh, I don't know. You don't know? Timmy! Uh-oh, the poisonous gas is being released. Hurry, hold your breath. All right, everyone, here's your gas mask. It will stop you from breathing in the poisonous gas being released. Uh, excuse me, I didn't get one. There's not enough gas masks for everyone. The families with the highest incomes are given it first. But that's not fair. The rest of us are going to die. We can't keep holding our breath forever. You'll have to try. Oh, no. It's not fair. They get masks and we don't. It's like they're trying to get rid of us. I know. And the times we're getting to hold our breath are getting longer and longer. Come on, pick up the pace. <sighs> Keep running. I can't. I'm out of breath. What? still alive oh no all the people who didn't have gas masks are dead not everyone brianna's still alive that's impossible how can she hold her breath for 10 minutes and still be alive omg you're alive no way how did you survive you didn't have a gas mask i don't know i couldn't hold my breath any longer so i just breathed in the gas so did i I'm not gonna fight it anymore. We breathed in the gas. How are we surviving? I think the people that died didn't die from the gas. They died from holding their breath. Look at your hand. Look at your hand. Oh no. I must have had some kind of reaction to the poisonous gas. Your face. It's turning green. <coughs> I don't feel so good. <gasps> it's not supposed to be time yet. Hold your breath as long as you can. It's impossible to hold our breath that long. I know. <coughs> Look at you. You're getting worse. Me? What about you? Look at your arm. I got the oxygen can 3000. It's way better than those silly gas masks. Hey, rich boy. Give me that oxygen tank. Here, I got you this oxygen tank. You need to use it right away. You're not breathing well at all. It's too late. Harry had a little lamb. Emily, stop little... singing. Where did you learn to sing? I don't know, I just heard it on the TV. 
You only sing when you want to kill someone. They play that on the TV because they want you to sing, but you can't, okay? Okay. Honey, are you off to school now? Yeah, I am. You forgot to wear your earplugs. You must always keep them on while you're in public. Do I have to wear them? It's for your protection. You never know when someone could start singing. Hey, girl. Hey. Ouch. Now I got your attention. What? Keep out those earplugs. I want to talk to you. My mom makes me wear them. She says you never know when someone could start singing. Come on, hand them over. We're at school. No one would start singing here. Ring around the rosies, a pocket full of... Help! Ring around the rosies, a pocket full of... Help! Rosies, ashes. Here's your earplugs back. I was wrong. You might actually need them. I saw someone die. Was it just him or were there others? There were three others who didn't cover their ears in time. Hey, they canceled school for the day. Go home and get some rest. Mom, I'm home. Mary had a little lamb. Emily, little stop lamb, singing. Little lamb. Emily, Mary why are you singing? I told you not to. It kills people. Lamb, its fleece was white Mom! Mom, there's something wrong with Emily. She won't stop singing. She's going to kill someone. Mary had a little lamb. Why are you singing? Little lamb. I need to get out of here. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, babe. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, baby. Why is everyone singing? Attention all citizens. Singing has now become contagious. You must wear earplugs at all times to stop the spread. Mary had a little lamb. Rock by baby on the treetops. Ashes, ashes. Everyone's singing. Hey, take out your earplugs. What? It's just me and you. It's just us? Yes. Okay. Ring around the rosies. Game leader, Brianna. Everyone, I'm in charge of do as I say, not as I do. Now remember, you have to copy what I say, not follow my actions, because my actions won't match what I say to do. Stop talking, everyone knows the rules already. Okay, everyone, clap your hands. Timmy, what are you doing? No, Timmy, you were supposed to clap your hands. I thought you said clap without hands. My brother! Give an instruction. Everyone, cross your arms. Dang it! <laughs> Brittany was copying your dad's moves. <laughs> no, Brittany. You were supposed to do as I say, not as I do. I forgot. <laughs> Brittany. No, oh, my girlfriend. Look what you've done, Brianna. I lost my girlfriend and my brother because of you. Jimmy, it's not my fault. They're supposed to do as I say, not as I do. They didn't follow the instructions properly. Maybe if you talked the louder, they could have heard the instructions properly. Why is it changing who's in charge? Ha, it's me. Play finish the lyric for one million dollars? Obviously I'm going to play. No, sweetie, did you just choose to play finish the lyric? Yes, I could win one million dollars. But if you guess the lyric wrong two times, you'll be eliminated. So? Eliminated from Earth. <coughs> You're not even the blank? What the? Grandma, you chose to play? Of course, it's a million dollars. I don't have much time left anyways. Hurry, right, give me a hint. <coughs> You're not even the tongue. No, what does it sound like? You're not even the bowel movement. You're not even the fart. No, my mother. Grandma. Hey, Timmy. I just got to finish the lyrics. Timmy, no! Stop screaming. I'm trying to think. Sorry. Merrily we fall blank, blank, blank. Timmy. What are you doing? I'm trying to remember how that dance goes. Huh? Look at her. She's no heart. That means no one's ever loved her. Makes sense. Who could ever love someone who looks like her? Hey, Brianna. Brittany, the most popular girl in the school? Why are you talking to me? I want to help you get boys to fall in love with you. That's impossible. No isn't an option. Let's go. <laughs> Here, wear this. Do you think you can cover up my acne? I can. You look beautiful with or without it, but the world's a cruel place. Please cover it. I don't want to be myself no more. I want to be loved. You did an amazing job on the makeup, Brittany. I never even could have dreamed that I would look like this. Come on, let's take some photos for your socials. Right. Great, but this time a little less terrified. Okay. 
Oh, who's the new girl? I didn't know we had a model at our school. She looks like a celebrity. Let's all take photos of her. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Brittany? Oh, my. The deadly challenge for today is here. Oh, no. We can only speak in jokes or else. That doesn't sound like a joke, Mom. Um, knock, knock. Who's there? You need to laugh at my joke or else I'll get eliminated. <laughs> <laughs> joke what's the joke my life <laughs> <laughs> hey brianna are you all right no you are all left <laughs> if no one finds your joke funny to me you'll be eliminated <laughs> <laughs> all right timmy you're safe for now class you know why six was afraid of seven because seven eight nine <laughs> <laughs> brianna what's the answer to number seven now, class, I'm not expecting a correct answer from her, because remember, she is a blonde. <laughs> I know the answer. What's funnier than 24? 25? <laughs> My dad makes better jokes than you. <laughs> for real, Jake, Brandon's not funny. Come on, put on your headband. You need to cover your eye. It's time for school. No, I don't want to put it on. You have to wear it. People can't know you have a third eye. My third eye says you're cheating on daddy. Get over here. <laughs> You must always keep your third eye covered because if the government finds out that you can see people's secrets, they'll try and take you away. <gasps> ho ho, headband head. Zip it, Jake. <laughs> headband head, what are you hiding under there? Brianna, are you okay? I'm fine. What's on your forehead that you're hiding? I'm your best friend and you've never even shown me. I'll show you, but you can't tell anyone about this, okay? I'm your best friend. You can trust me. Why do you have an eye on your head? I would hide that too. There's more. You've been seeing my boyfriend behind my back? You've been seeing my boyfriend behind my back? I would never. You're my best friend. I love you. You're a liar. You know what? Pretend you didn't see anything. You're not my best friend anymore. Come on, Bree. Babe, what's wrong? I need you to keep your eyes closed and not open them until I say so. What? Why? Just do it! Okay, I will! Sheesh! You're in love with my best friend! I'm not! What the- I told you to keep your eyes closed! Brianna, can I see your third eye? Who told you? Remove your headband and we'll tell you. I said who told you! It was Stephanie. Stephanie! Stephanie! You told everyone about my third eye! Bree, no! I didn't tell anyone, I promise! Makes sense why your dad never came back with the milk. How do you know? Wait, your eye has a special power, doesn't it? Me, me, let's play house. You be the wife, I'll be the- Me, spell witch. Um, B-I. Timmy, there's no B in witch. I thought he said- to me! Oopsies, I'll try again. W-E. Try again. You have one more chance to spell it right. Okay, um, W-H-I-C-H. Timmy, I think that's the wrong kind of witch. Brianna, spell Timmy. T-I-M-M-Y. Honey? What is it, Grandma? I'm trying to finish my homework. I just woke up. Is today Wednesday? No, today's Friday. What? I just woke up from a nap. Are you telling me I slept through Wednesday and Thursday? Yeah, Grandma, you did. I thought you had expired. Grandma, spell Wednesday. But I don't know how to spell. You have to try. W-H. Oh, come on, you little... I love stealing Big Sissy's makeup. It's so much fun. Brianna, you did something wrong. You stole your Big Sister's makeup. Now you must make things right. You must right your wrong before the timer runs out or else you die. Live or die, the choice is up to you. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I stole your lipstick and I put it all over my face. It was a mistake and I really hope you forgive me. <laughs> I can't believe you took my lipstick again. What's wrong with you? You're such a little brat. Wait, don't worry about it, okay? I forgive you. I love you. I love you, sissy. Mommy, when's dinner ready? I cheated, I cheated on you. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to. What? Ah, daddy! Cover your eyes. <laughs> This is all your guys' fault. You kids are so bad, he wouldn't have found another woman. Or maybe you're just a terrible wife. Don't you? Guys, stop fighting. I just got a timer over my head.
So did I. Baby, you're just a terrible wife. Don't you? Guys, stop fighting. I just got a timer over my head. So did I. Mom, I'm sorry. I didn't mean what I said. I only said it because I was mad at you. Yeah, okay, whatever, fine. I'm sorry too, okay? And I forgive you. Why is the timer still going off? I made my wrong right. I said sorry. You have to mean it, Mom. Okay, okay, I mean it. Come on, stop. Sissy, don't look. This is bull. Hey, any luck finding a job? Not yet. It's really been hard for me to take care of you on my own since Mom died. If we don't find a way to get money soon, you'll have to be put in foster care. I can't take care of you anymore. I'll find a job soon, okay? Hey, have a good day at school, okay? We'll figure this out. I love you. Oh. Um. <laughs> sir! Sir! You dropped your wallet. Oh, how did I not notice? Thank you so much. No problem. Brianna, you did something wrong. It's time to right your wrong or face the consequences of your actions. Brianna, you did something wrong. It's time to right your wrong or face the consequences of your actions. Sir! Sir, wait! Sir! I stole money from your wallet before giving it back to you. I knew it was wrong and I'm so sorry I did that. I just couldn't help myself. I really need the money and I wasn't thinking. Thank you. It's very brave of you to own up to your actions. You're a good person. No. I'm not a good person. If there was no consequence to my action, I wouldn't have gave the money back. You are a good person because someone who is bad would never truly believe what they did was wrong. Here, take this, consider it a gift. Sir, I can't accept this. I won't accept it back, so you might as well keep it. But I don't deserve it. Yes, you do. Have a good day. That voice. Wait, where did he go? Hey, Professor, sorry I'm late. Your professor's not here. Today I'll be the one teaching the class. Brianna looks like she's seen a ghost. <laughs> Now, Brittany. Brianna looks like she's seen a ghost. <laughs> now, Brittany. Making fun of someone is not a very nice thing to do. Apologize or face the consequences. The substitute teacher is the controller of right or wrong. What? Anyways, I guess I need to apologize. I'm so sorry that you're so easy to make fun of. Brittany, no, that's not an apology. Fine. I'm so sorry your face looks so silly when you're scared. No! Brittany! You're not going anywhere. You've got a lot of learning to do. Mmm, cookie. Can I see? Sure. Give me that. <gasps> Timmy, give me my cookie back. Timmy, stealing someone's food without permission is not right. Make it right or die. <gasps> okay, here. You already took a bite out of it. Hold out your hand. I can give it back. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. You keep it. Hello? Sissy, the control of right or wrong is in my classroom. Brianna's using her phone in class. Timmy! I have to complete 100 tasks today? There's no way I'll be able to complete them all by the end of the day. You have to try, because if you don't complete them all, you die. Run to school. I have to run to school. Bye, Mom! Ew, why are you all sweaty? My first task of the day was to run to school. How many tasks did you get today? I got 10. No way, I got 100! That's a lot. I don't know how you're going to be able to complete them all. I know, they're trying to eliminate me. Enter the class late and balk like a chicken. Brianna, you're late. <laughs> what? I think I just got the ick. No, Jiggy. Rip your test and say you're the Muffin Man. I am the Muffin Man. Brianna, disrupt my class again and you'll be going to detention. Sorry, sir. Guess what? I only got one task today. That's great. What's your task? To kill you. Good morning. Mom, I have like 10 sweaters on. Why is the house freezing cold? The government released a temperature meter to help you find your soulmate. The hotter it is, the closer you are to your soulmate, and the colder it is, the farther away you are from your soulmate. Where is my soulmate? The moon? It's finally starting to warm up a bit. Not for me. Brr. I'm even colder than I was this morning. I feel heat coming from that way. You should follow it then. It will lead you to your soulmate. I need to go towards the heat. I've been freezing all morning long. It's getting warmer. Follow the heat. What are you doing? I'm following the heat. Oh, it's getting hot. This door, it's like it's on fire. That's where my soulmate must be. Oh my gosh. Why is it so hot in here? Excuse me, are you in the right classroom? What are you doing here? My soulmate's in this classroom, but I gotta go. It is way too hot in here. 
Ah! Oh my gosh, it's finally cooling down. It's so nice and cool over here, bestie. Says you, I've been freezing all morning. Brr. So, did you find your soulmate? No, I found out which classroom my soulmate's in, but I couldn't get close. I started overheating. How am I supposed to find my soulmate if it gets unbearably hot every time we get close? Only at first. You two need to introduce yourselves to each other. Once you introduce yourselves to each other, the temperature will become perfect. Why does no one tell me these things? Why is it getting so hot? You're so hot. It's getting so cold all of a sudden. Is your soulmate still breathing? If he's not alive, you'll freeze to death. Wake up! Oh. Hurry, Bree. Introduce yourself to your soulmate. Hi, my name is Brianna. Hello? Hello? I'm still freezing. That's because he also needs to introduce himself to you. Is he still breathing? He's breathing, but he's not responding. He needs to go to a hospital. Now. Yeah. Well, doctor, is my soulmate going to be okay? It's not looking good right now. It appears he's had a heart attack. Oh no, he must have had a heart attack when he saw me because I'm so beautiful. No, he has a history of heart problems. Please wake up. I want to meet you. I have some unfortunate news. We believe this man may be brain dead. He won't be able to communicate and his organs will start to fail. No, doctor. If he goes, I'm going to freeze. We aren't 100% sure, but we're going to run some tests to confirm it. Please introduce yourself to me. I'm going to freeze. Hi. I'm Timmy. I love you. Doctor, doctor, he's responding! Oh, no. oh Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree! Bree, my deadly curse is I can't open my eyes. Ouch! What's your deadly curse? Sing songs of cheer! You have to sing songs? What kind of songs? Christmas! Christmas. Hey, babe, what do you want for Christmas this year? All I want for Christmas is you. Wow. Brianna, please take me back. I'm still in love with you. Come on. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Please take me back. I know I messed up. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. But the very next day, you gave it away. Why do you keep singing? Here, let me serenade you. Last Christmas, I gave you my... I really can't stay. Wait. I've got to go. I've got to go away! Let her go, man. You should get to class now, babe. Brianna, why isn't your boyfriend John in class? Looks like your ex, Jimmy, isn't in class either. Where is... Where is the laughter? Where are you, baby? Pow, pow, pow! Ka-chow, ka-chow! Pow, pow, pow! Ka-chow, pow! How can you do this thing to me? Brianna, I'll do anything for you. Just give me one more chance. I ought to say no, 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 sir. Please, one more chance. The answer is no. Last Christmas. We should get out of here. So come on, let's go. Wait, I want to know, why did you pick me? I love you. I love you, I meant it. You really love me? Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Don't go to school. Don't go. Actually, I'm not going to school today. I feel sick. Hello? Brianna, are you okay? Are you somewhere safe? Yeah, I'm fine. I just didn't go to school today. Well, it's a good thing you didn't. There were masked intruders at our school. Some people didn't make it out safely. And the worst part is, the police haven't caught them yet. One second, Chad's calling. Hey, baby. I miss seeing you today. Yeah, I missed you too, baby. Am I still coming over? No, don't let Chad come over. Chad, it's actually best if you don't come today. But I want to see you. I miss... Hello? Help, help. Let me in. Someone's chasing me. Please, don't let her in. Hello? Help, help. Let me in. Someone's chasing me. Please, don't let her in. Hurry, they're chasing me. Who? Who's chasing you? I don't know, some crazy people wearing masks. Are they close? No, they're far away. Hurry. She's lying. Open up, they found me. <coughs> You're coming with me. Help, help, help. 
Mom, where are you? When are you coming home? I'm 15 minutes away. I'm stuck in traffic. Tell her not to come. Don't let her come. Mom, you can't come home right now. Why not? You just can't. Just don't come. Hey, baby. How are you feeling? Chad, how did you get in here? Your window was open. Be careful. Oops, I dropped my... I'll get it. Chad, why do you have a mask? Because you're next. Freeze tag. Help. Help. Unfreeze me. Please. <laughs> Teacher. Teacher. Unfreeze. Derek, that game is very dangerous. It's only used to kill people. You know the rules. You play free tech and you're expelled. Attention everyone, you will no longer be expelled for playing free tech. In fact, the government encourages it and you will receive a cash reward if you play. This can't be real. That's awful. Who would play that game? Free tag! Help me, I'm frozen! Unfreeze. Derek, don't do that! Did you hear what Derek did? No. What did he do? He's running around the school playing freeze tag. He's killed two people already. And the worst part is, he received money for those he killed. Let's run this way. Derek's coming. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Freeze tag, Derek. No, unfreeze me. Freeze tag. Bestie, why did you just freeze me? Freeze tag. Bestie, why did you just freeze me? Unfreeze. Hurry, unfreeze me too. Oh no, it's too late. Seriously? Freezing your own best friend? Why would you do that? I'm so sorry. Sorry that you tried to kill me? Things are bad at home right now. I really needed the prize money. I wasn't thinking. What you did was unforgivable. Don't talk to me anymore. Hey, you killed my boyfriend. Who, Derek? I think I did you a favor. Freeze tag. You're gonna get what you deserve. No! Unfreeze. Jake! Freeze tag. No, unfreeze me. She's the one who killed Derek. Let's get out of here. This school's gone crazy. I know, it's getting really dangerous around here. Hey, you and I should maybe team up. Freeze tag. No, please unfreeze me. Now that you and I are a team, I won't let anybody hurt you. Me too. Somebody help me. <laughs> it's really dangerous around here. Follow me. Let's go this way. Yeah. Here, take my hand. Here you go. This is your gown. Before you enter the class, you must put this on. What are these? These gowns will be used to keep you safe while you're in class. While you have them on, no one will be able to tag you. Now remember everyone, these gowns are only used to keep you safe while you're in class so you can learn. Once class is over, you must dispose of them immediately. This place is getting insane. It's not fair they make us take off those gowns. Freeze tag. Jake! Unfreeze. Freeze tag. Bessie, why'd you freeze me? You froze Jake. I'm sorry, I didn't know you two were friends. You're not going to let me die, right? I'm your best friend. Freeze tag. Bestie, why'd you freeze me? You froze Jake. I'm sorry, I didn't know you two were friends. You're not going to let me die, right? You're my best friend. <laughs> hey, are you okay? I can't believe I just let my best friend die. What have I become? Ha ha ha, freeze tag. No. Come on, we have to go. It's not safe here. You're always looking out for me, Jake. Yeah, I am. Do you remember Derek? Yeah, he was the worst. I'm glad I froze him. He was my best friend. What? Yeah, since preschool. Freeze tag. When Derek's girlfriend froze you, I knew I had to save you because I'm the one who should get revenge for my best friend. I'm not frozen, Jake. What? How? The gown. These gowns will be used to keep you safe while you're in class. Will you have them on? No one can tag you. Red Rover, Red Rover, we call Brianna over. Mommy, there's little girls calling me. You need to find them. They'll be holding hands and you need to break through or they'll take you. <laughs> <laughs> Come join us, Brianna. You're almost out of time. <coughs> this morning, little girls called me to play Red Rover. My mommy says it's not real. It's just a myth. It's a fake story. You're lying. No, it's not. I saw them. I had to break through their hands. Stop lying. Red Rover, Red Rover, we call Ellie over. Who's there? Who's calling me? Ellie, do you hear them? The little girls? You need to find them and break through or they'll take you. I don't believe you. Hurry up. You only have 20 seconds. No, no, it's not real. Ellie, hurry up. Do you hear them, the little girls? 
You need to find them and break through, or they'll take you! I don't believe you! Hurry up! You only have 20 seconds! No, no, it's not real! Ellie, hurry up! Come join us, Ellie! Ah! <laughs> Ellie, you survived! I know, I'm so lucky! So it is real, the game of Red Rover? Yes, it is! I saw them, the little girls! I told you guys it was real. You didn't believe me. Red Rover, Red Rover. We call Katie over. Don't play Red Rover. The little girls might hear you and call you over. We are the little girls. So that means they, they... They took us. And you're going to be next. No, no, please tell me you're joking. <laughs> What's on my neck? One, one, six, one? Sissy! Sissy, did you draw on my neck last night while I was sleeping? No, I didn't! Liar! That's your elimination number. Elimination number? It's for population control. How it works is someone is randomly given three numbers above their head and they must choose one to eliminate. Everyone will keep on choosing numbers until the desired population is reached. Well, you guys need to show me your numbers then so I don't choose you by mistake. Two, two, three, four. Eight, six, three, one. Two, two, three, four, and eight, six, three, one. Got it. I'll make sure not to choose those. Sweetie, is everything okay? It's my turn to eliminate a number. What numbers did you get? It's both of your numbers and some random number. Five, six, seven, eight. I'll just choose that one. Hey, Jenny, where's Jake? I miss my boyfriend. He was eliminated this morning. Oh, no. Once I find out who chose five, six, seven, eight and eliminated my brother, they're going to be eliminated next. Why did you seem so shocked after hearing that number? No reason, I'm just so shocked that my boyfriend's gone from me so soon! And why are you covering your neck? Oh, it's nothing, my neck is just a little cold. You're acting really guilty right now, Brianna. Oh, would you look at that? It's my turn to eliminate a number. My options are... 8631 That's little sissy! 1161 4632 Yeah, my number's 4632! So don't choose that one, okay? Prove it to me. Show me your neck so I won't choose that one. I just want to be sure. No, I don't really see the need for that. They're doing two number eliminations at once? What numbers did they give you? 1678 3214 5787. Oh no. Are any of those your numbers? Uh, maybe. Well, you should probably stop hiding your numbers so that I don't accidentally choose it. Fine, we'll show each other our numbers at the same time. Ready? Harry had a little lamb. Emily, stop singing. Where did you learn to sing? I don't know. I just heard it on the TV. You only sing when you want to kill someone. They play that on the TV because they want you to sing, but you can't, okay? Okay. Honey, are you off to school now? Yeah, I am. You forgot to wear your earplugs. You must always keep them on while you're in public. Do I have to wear them? It's for your protection. You never know when someone could start singing. Hey, girl. Hey. Ouch. Now I got your attention. What? Keep out those earplugs. I want to talk to you. My mom makes me wear them. She says you never know when someone could start singing. Come on, hand them over. We're at school. No one would start singing here. Ring around the rosies. A pocket full of... Oh! Ring around the rosies, a pocket full of who? Rosies, ashes. Here's your earplugs back. I was wrong. You might actually need them. I saw someone die. Was it just him or were there others? There were three others who didn't cover their ears in time. Hey, they canceled school for the day. Go home and get some rest. Mom, I'm home. Mary had a little lamb. Emily, little stop lamb. singing. Little Emily, Mary why are you singing? I told you not to. It kills people. Lamb, its fleece was white as Mom! Mom, there's something wrong with Emily. She won't stop singing. She's going to kill someone. Mary had a little lamb. Why are you singing? Little lamb. I need to get out of here. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, baby. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, baby. Why is everyone singing? Attention all citizens. Singing has now become contagious. You must wear earplugs at all times to stop the spread. Mary had a little lamb. Rock a bye baby on the treetops. Ashes, ashes. Everyone's singing. Hey, 
Take out your earplugs. What? It's just me and you. It's just us? Yes. Okay. Ring around the rosies. Ring around the rosies. Brianna, what rhymes with fool? What rhymes with fool? School. Correct. That was easy. Speaking of school, Emily, hurry up. We're going to be late. I'm ready. Emily, what rhymes with orange? Orange, but nothing rhymes with orange. There's got to be something that rhymes with orange. Storage, porridge. Emily, they have to be actual words. Sporange? No, Emily, that's not a word. Correct. I got it. Oh, awesome. Why aren't you girls at school yet? We're heading to school now, Mom. Mom, what rhymes with daughters? Daughters, that should be an easy word for you to rhyme. Right, Mom? I don't know. I can't think clearly today. I'm so tired. It's okay. You can do it. Just clear your head. Um, daughters. Mom. I can't. Mom, please. <laughs> Mommy. My mother. Brianna, what rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. Brianna, what rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. <laughs> Mommy. Emily, stop crying. I'm trying to think. I want Mommy. Mommy's gone, okay? She's gone, and she's never coming back! Brother. Correct. <laughs> hey, Emily, I'm sorry I acted that way. I'll walk myself to school today. Don't follow me. Emily! Bree, you good? My mom couldn't rhyme the word this morning, and my sister won't even talk to me, so yeah, I'm not doing great. Brianna, what rhymes with sister? Miss her. Correct. Man, that's tough. Here, do my assignment for me. Brittany, what rhymes with assignment? Nothing rhymes with assignment because assignment isn't even a real word. Assignment is most definitely a real word. Assignment, hmm. Come on, Brittany, use your brain. I don't need to use my brain because I'm pretty. Brittany! Brianna, something happened to your sister. Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Your sister's school called. They said she never showed up to class. What? Do you know where she might be? Just give me a minute. I need to rhyme the word. Frost. Correct. I need to find my sister. I need to talk to you. Let me go. I need to find my sister. I want to get back together, babe. You cheated on me. Jake, what rhymes with cheated? You're not going anywhere. You're going to help me rhyme this word. Hot, hot. When you're hot, you were... Um, warm, did it? That's not a good hint. Give me a better one. During our relationship, you blank me. I cheated on you? <laughs> You mistreated me. Emily, Emily, are you out here? I'm sorry I yelled at you. I love you. Sissy? Emily. I'm so glad you're here. I was so lost. Emily, what rhymes with love? Hi, I'm Brianna, and today I'm going to be making a candy salad with all my friends. I brought the Sour Patch. My name is Miss Applewood, and I brought the mint. Applewood, you were supposed to bring a sweet candy, not a minty one. I gotta sneeze. Ah! No. Ah! Hey, I'm Timmy, and I brought the mamba. Hi, I'm Eugene, and I brought the nerves. Hi, my name's Brittany, and I brought the sweet tarts because I am just so sweet. What's up, everyone? I'm Jake, and I brought the sour, chewy nerves. Bon appetit. I think I lost my dentures in there. Tim, me. Let's play. I want you, but I'm so tired. Oh, oh, oh. oh I'm getting kind of tired now, too. Timmy has a yawning disease. I'll get him. <laughs> yawning is an extremely contagious disease. If you hear someone yawning, you must get out of there immediately. Because if you catch the yawning disease, you'll be eliminated. Everyone, here are your ice packs. Pressing a cold compress against yourself will help prevent you from yawning. These are only preventative measures, but if you catch the yawning disease, there's no cure. All this talking's making me tired. Oh. Jimmy has the yawning disease. Everyone out! Hey, babe, you okay? I know Jimmy was your best friend. Yeah, I think I'll be okay. I'm just really tired. Oh. Brianna, is everything all right? Why are you running? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just... I'm a little tired. Red Rover, Red Rover, we call Brianna over. Mommy, 
There's little girls calling me. You need to find them. They'll be holding hands and you need to break through or they'll take you. <gasps> <laughs> Come join us, Brianna. You're almost out of time. <coughs> this morning, little girls called me to play Red Rover. My mommy says it's not real. It's just a myth. It's a fake story. You're lying. No, it's not. I saw them. I had to break through their hands. Stop lying. Red Rover, Red Rover. We call Ellie over. Who's there? Who's calling me? Ellie, do you hear them? The little girls? You need to find them and break through or they'll take you. I don't believe you. Hurry up. You only have 20 seconds. No, no, it's not real. Ellie, hurry up. Do you hear them? The little girls? You need to find them and break through or they'll take you. I don't believe you. Hurry up. You only have 20 seconds. No, no, it's not real. Ellie, hurry up. Come join us, Ellie. Ellie, you survived. I know, I'm so lucky. So it is real, the game of Red Rover? Yes, it is, I saw them, the little girls. I told you guys it was real. You didn't believe me. Red Rover, Red Rover. We call Katie over. Don't play Red Rover, the little girls might hear you and call you over. We are the little girls. So that means they... They... They took us. And you're going to be next. No, oh, no, please tell me you're joking. <laughs> Continue being a doll or become a human. I've always wanted to be a human. Oh, honey, you're awake. I just started making breakfast. Here, you should have something to drink. You must be thirsty. Refreshing. Thank you. Um, darling, the water's actually supposed to go in your mouth. Sorry, it's my first day being a human. Brianna, there you are. Brianna? What's a Brianna? Um, you, that's your name. Well, I used to be a doll. Babe, I've missed you so much. Come here. Why would you do that? Because we're boyfriend and girlfriend. That's what we do. Hey, are you actually a doll or were you a doll? Mm -hmm. Yes. Then that means you've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Please, please listen to me. I am not a doll. I am a human trapped inside a doll. This doll's so advanced. Who programmed her? I wasn't programmed. I'm human. I need to get out of here. <sighs> <laughs> You're not going to get very far with plastic legs. This doll's kind of weird. Do you think any kids will buy a human trapped in a doll doll? I don't think so, boss. That's not very popular amongst kids. I told you, I am not a doll. Yeah, I don't think she'll sell. If no one buys her by the end of the day, we'll throw her in the garbage. Wow, I want this doll. She looks so realistic. Little girl, I am not a doll. I am a human. You've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Do you know where you used to live when you were a doll? That must be where the real Brianna is. I used to live in a room with lots of other dolls where little kids would come and stare at us. Oh, a toy store. Babe, you look so beautiful today. <laughs> Stop it, Jake. That's not the real Brianna. Okay, but it still looks like her. Why does my face feel so warm? Because you're blushing. Now, come on. We have to find out which toy store you're from. You were Brianna's best friend? Not were. I am Brianna's best friend. I've never had a friend before. My eyes are feeling wet. That's because you're about to cry. Cry? Okay, this is a toy store. Do you recognize it? Yes, this used to be my home. I want to leave. Hello, ladies. Could I help you find anything? Why does your friend look so scared? She's just like that. Do you have a doll that's like super realistic? Kind of seems like a human. Yeah, a little girl just stole her. <laughs> Thank you for saying that to me. It really helped me understand. I'm sorry. I want to buy you, but I don't have any money. You don't need any money. You just need to carry me and run. You're pretty heavy. Thank you for getting me out of there. Now I'll show you where the best place to find me is. My high school. Okay, you show me the way and I'll carry you. Wait, before we go, I must ask. Won't your parents be worried about you? My parents won't be worried about me because I don't have any parents. I'm an orphan.
I don't have any friends either. That's why I wanted a doll so bad, so I could have someone to play with and keep me company. I'll make you a deal. Once you get me back in my human body, I'll buy you as many dolls as you would like. Who are you looking at? My best friend Stephanie! And me! What are we going to do now? A little girl stole the real Brianna. Hey, look over there! That's me! Come on, hurry! Let's catch up to them! Brianna, wait! Stephanie! And me! Me when I was a doll. We found the real Brianna, but how are we going to get your body switched back? I have an option to go back as a doll, but I'm sorry, I can't do it. I don't want to go back to that toy store and that bad man. No, you have to give Brianna's body back. You're a doll, and she's a human. You can't steal her body. I have an idea. If you choose to go back as a doll, you can come back with me and be my doll. We'll be best friends. A friend? I've never had a friend before. Okay, I'll choose it. I'm back in my body. I'm back as a doll. Stephanie, I've missed you so much. I'm so excited to bring you home with me. Yes, you and I are going to have so much fun. <laughs> Yay! Mommy, can I have a lollipop? No, sweetie, no sweets for you. <coughs> Honey, stop pouting. You need to smile right now. It's the new beauty standard. You need to or else bye-bye from Earth. Good job. Keep smiling. Mommy, can I stop smiling now? My mouth is hurting from smiling so much. That's too bad. You still need to keep smiling. Why do I even need to fit the beauty standard? I'm only a kid. Use your hands and turn that frown upside down. <gasps> oh no, I need to get big lips right away. I already have big lips. There, beautiful. Wow, your lips look so big. Are you kidding me? There, no lips. Sophie, why do you still have big lips? What? The beauty standard changed. Someone doesn't fit the beauty standard. No, my lips aren't this big. It's just makeup. Prove it now or else. I can't. <laughs> Sophie! Was that concealer I saw on your hand earlier? Mom! Use this makeup wipe and prove there's no makeup on your lips. Show me now. You're good to go. You didn't even need concealer. Your lips are extremely thin. Thank you. I think. The beauty standard changed again? There. Lots of freckles. <laughs> Timmy, are you okay? Why are you hiding in a corner? Shh, I don't want them to find me. I don't have freckles. Don't worry, Timmy. I can help you get freckles. Oh, look. Little Timmy doesn't fit the beauty standard. Brenna, this is all your fault! Class, I think you all know what you need to do. This is the most painless option you have. Mm, mm -mm. Brittany, where's your mouth? You actually got rid of it? Mm, 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 mm. The beauty standard changed again. Being young, what's gonna happen to all the old people? Our teachers? Our parents? Our grandparents? Mm, 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 mm. I need to call my mom. Mom, whatever you do, don't go out. You need to stay in the house and hide, okay? Until the beauty standard changes. Okay, sweetie. I love you. I love you. Looks like I found an oldie. I'm not old, I'm 17. That's what they all say. Here, my ID. Oh, wow. You look at least 24. Get to class, Brittany. Mm -mm. Mrs. Smith, you need to hide. Did you not see the beauty standard change? Oh, no, I didn't even notice. No eyes. Here, Brianna. This should help you with that. What do you want me to do with this? You know exactly what you have to do to fit the beauty standard. After you. All right, I'll go first. But if you don't do it, I'll call the beauty police. <laughs> you wouldn't. Beauty! Ah! I can't see where I'm going. Mm -mm. Brittany, what happened to your eyes? Do you think that anyone actually finds these things beautiful? Or are all these beauty standards just for control? Oh, thank goodness. Oh, no. Come on, Mom. Pick up, pick up. Mom, I'm calling because this might be the last time you'll ever hear from me. I'm dressed up as an elderly woman right now, but I might get caught. I just want you to know that I love you so, so, so much. 
Bold of you to assume that your mom will ever get your message. These beauty standards are getting insane. I know they are, because I'm the one creating them. What? You know how many people are gone because of you? How many people you hurt? And what about me? What about the people who hurt me? Sorry? Do you want to know why I created these beauty standards? It was all for a little girl who never fit them. My skin wasn't clear enough. My eyes couldn't see well enough. My lips weren't big enough. And my hair wasn't shiny enough. And because of that, I was made fun of. She has no lips. How will she get a kiss kiss? No kiss for her. <laughs> Hi. Sorry, this table is only for girls who meet the beauty standard. No nerds. I'm not a nerd just because I wear glasses. Too bad. You're still not pretty enough to sit with us. <laughs> <laughs> when I got older, I started working for the government. They were looking for new ways for population control. So I suggested that everyone must always fit the current beauty standard or else. And because the beauty standard is always changing, no one can ever fit it. And beauty becomes meaningless. Someone here looks very young. It's that young lady right there. You guys really think I look young? I mean... Even though she makes the beauty standards, she can still go bye-bye? Say bye-bye. Wait, look! The beauty standard changed again! <laughs> there. Beautiful. Huh, <laughs> nice makeup. Thanks! Hey, wait. Could I get your help with something? Hey, Mrs. Smith, I love your makeup. What do you want now? You know, I'm surprised people used to make fun of you for not being beautiful. I always thought you were beautiful. Really? You did? Yeah, I really did. But you know what? You look even more beautiful without makeup. Here, let me see your natural beauty. What do you think? Do I really look beautiful? You do. The people who used to make fun of you were so wrong. You don't fix the beauty standard. That was a good idea you had. I was getting sick of her. Well, you're in charge now. What will the next beauty standard be? I know exactly what I want it to be. Everyone's beautiful. Nice. Brianna, I like you. You, Timmy! Ugh! Eh! Why did I just get money? Mommy, today at school, when Timmy said he liked me, I got money! Honey, that's because every time someone has a crush on you, you get money. So you're saying... I could be rich? Hey girl, do you want to go to the mall after school? I can't, I'm broke. How are you broke? Just go get boys to like you. I don't know how to get boys to like me. It's easy. Just do the bend and snap method. Bend and snap method? Drop something on the floor and go to pick it up. Hey, boys. Don't talk to us. Oops. Whoa. I got it. Bro, I caught that on video. That bend and snap method of yours really works. I'm making bang. It's because of this. Look, the video the boys took of you went viral. <gasps> no way. Uh-oh, Brianna? Uh-oh, Brianna? There's a new video. You might want to see this. Oops. Whoa. I got it. You said it's giving boys the ick. When someone crushes on you, you get money. But if you give them the ick, you lose it. But it's not fair. I didn't fart, and I don't really look like that. No, I've almost lost all of my crushes. Does it say who posted that video? It was Jake. Jake! Hey, Farty. Chad, where's Jake? I'm not telling you. Look, it's Farty Pin. Jake! Jake, take the video down. It's making me lose all my money and my crushes. I'm not taking the video down because I don't want you to have any crushes. Why not? Because I'm in love with you. Huh? <laughs> huh? Oh, my. Someone made another edit of you. <laughs> huh? Oh my, someone made another edit of you. It's Farty Pan. Jake! What the? Who even took that video? I took it. I saw you standing there so lovely, and I just couldn't help myself. Timmy, you still have a crush on me? Brianna, marry me, please! Just give me a chance! Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, are you alright? They were a little crazy. Yeah, I'm fine. Maybe having so many crushes isn't that great. Don't worry. I'll protect you. Brianna, did you see that new edit of you? You must have lots of new crushes now. Yeah, I did. I have enough money to go with you to the mall after school now. Hey, Brianna, I really enjoyed spending time with you today. I really like you. Do you think maybe we could go on a date sometime? Jake, I've had a crush on you for years. But when you tried to destroy my image, that gave me the ick. Good morning, Mom. 
I spy with my little eye my mom. Here, take your vision blocking glasses. I spy with my little eye these vision blocking glasses. Wear them as much as you can so you don't have to say I spy all the time. I barely take mine off. I spy with my little eye the ground. I spy with my little eye the bush. I spy with my little eye the bus. Class, can anyone tell me why the earth is flat? My eyes are so itchy. My glasses, where'd they go? Timmy, say I spy. I spy with... I spy with my little eye a beautiful girl named Brianna. Chad, is that you? Of course it's me. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I... I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. I spy with my little eye, Chad. Give me back my glasses. No way. I lost mine. Catch me if you can. I spy with my little eye, the wall. I spy with my little eye, Chad. I spy with my little eye, my vision blocking glasses. Hey, give them back. No, they're mine. And if you have your eyes open, you need to say I spy. I spy with my little... Chad? Chad? Attention everyone. For population control, you may no longer wear your vision blocking glasses or keep your eyes closed for an extended period of time. Anyone who breaks these rules will be killed. I spy with my little eye. Everyone, here are your soulmate heart lockets. Only your soulmate will have the key to your heart, and only you will have the key to their heart. Jake is going to be your soulmate for sure. You guys are made for each other. You guys really think so? Hey, Brianna, do you think I could see for soulmates? Ew, nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Imagine your soulmate is nerdy Nathan. <laughs> no, Nathan, there's no way you're my soulmate. You're a nerd. That was a little harsh. Here's your test back, Brianna. No way, you got 100%. You're smart. No. Brianna, are you a nerd now? You should quit cheerleading and join the chess club with nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Nathan. Jake, it's time to see if we have the key to each other's hearts. I really hope you're my soulmate. You're the hottest girl in the school. And what else? That's it, you're hot. Nothing else matters, babe. I guess. Does it fit? It... Does it fit? It doesn't. You're not my soulmate, Jake. So what? Who cares about a soulmate? That soulmate stuff is fake anyways. We're still gonna be together, right? We're both the hottest and most popular people in the school. Yeah, of course. So are you and Jake soulmates? We're not. No way, but you guys were made for each other. But we're still gonna be together. Yay! You two are the perfect couple. Jake, why don't you break up with Brianna and just be with me? No way. She's way harder than you. You're just my side girlfriend. Why am I not even surprised? You deserve so much better than him. Just mind your business, nerdy Nathan. Hey, Nathan. I'm sorry I yelled at you earlier. I was just really hurt. I'm used to it. Someone dropped their heart key. It unlocks my heart. Good morning. Mom, I have like 10 sweaters on. Why is the house freezing cold? The government released a temperature meter to help you find your soulmate. The hotter it is, the closer you are to your soulmate, and the colder it is, the farther away you are from your soulmate. Where is my soulmate, the moon? It's finally starting to warm up a bit. Not for me, brr. I'm even colder than I was this morning. I feel heat coming from that way. You should follow it then, it will lead you to your soulmate. I need to go towards the heat. I've been freezing all morning long. It's getting warmer. Follow the heat. What are you doing? I'm following the heat! Oh, it's getting hot. This door, it's like it's on fire. That's where my soulmate must be. Oh my gosh, why is it so hot in here? Excuse me, are you in the right classroom? What are you doing here? My soulmate's in this classroom. But I gotta go. It is way too hot in here. Oh my gosh, it's finally cooling down. It's so nice and cool over here, bestie. Says you, I've been freezing all morning. Brr. So, did you find your soulmate? No, I found out which classroom my soulmate's in, but I couldn't get close, I started overheating. How am I supposed to find my soulmate if it gets unbearably hot every time we get close? 
Only at first. You two need to introduce yourselves to each other. Once you introduce yourselves to each other, the temperature will become perfect. Why does no one tell me these things? Why is it getting so hot? You're so hot. It's getting so cold all of a sudden. Is your soulmate still breathing? If he's not alive, you'll freeze to death. Wake up! Oh. Hurry, Bree. Introduce yourself to your soulmate. Hi, my name is Brianna. Hello? Hello? I'm still freezing. That's because he also needs to introduce himself to you. Is he still breathing? He's breathing, but he's not responding. He needs to go to a hospital. Now. Yeah. Well, doctor, is my soulmate going to be okay? It's not looking good right now. It appears he's had a heart attack. Oh no, he must have had a heart attack when he saw me because I'm so beautiful. No, he has a history of heart problems. Please wake up. I want to meet you. I have some unfortunate news. We believe this man may be brain dead. He won't be able to communicate and his organs will start to fail. No, doctor. If he goes, I'm going to freeze. We aren't 100% sure, but we're going to run some tests to confirm it. Please introduce yourself to me. I'm going to freeze. Hi, I'm Timmy. I love you. Doctor, doctor, he's responding! Bye, Mom, I'm off to school. Here, you should take your umbrella. It's raining cats and dogs outside. Come on, Mom, it can't be that bad. On second thought, I'll take that umbrella. For the class project, you'll be partnered with Steve. Who's Steve? I never met him. We've literally been in the same class for years. Hi, Steve. Meeting someone for the first time can be awkward. Do you mind if I break the ice? Go ahead. Great. What did you get on the test, Brianna? An A, obviously. <laughs> liar, liar, pants on fire. Ah! Ah, my pants! My pants on fire! My pants on fire! How much for this granola bar? They're not cheap. It'll cost you an arm and a leg. Are you serious right now? That's so expensive. Don't blame me. Blame inflation. It's just an arm, okay? All right. I guess that's fine. Oh, no. It's a serial killer. Ah! Guys, relax. It's just cereal. Ah! Hey, Brianna. Are you ready for the test today? No, I didn't study. Then you really should hit the books. Yeah. <laughs> You may begin writing your test. Stephanie, I'm really worried about this test. Don't worry, Brie. It's a piece of cake. Oh, it's a piece of cake. <laughs> Stephanie, you're not going to believe what I just found out about Timmy. Come on, spill the tea. There was no tea wasted in the making of this video. Brianna, you told Stephanie my secret? Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to lose your marbles. And you lost your marbles, Timmy. Here's your test back. <gasps> I got a 70%. I got 100 Careful, you're turning green with envy. I'm not envious. You're green. Ah! Whoa, you all right there, Timmy? You're lucky I was there to save you. You saved me. I love you. <laughs> I love you too, Timmy. We live, we love, we lie. Timmy, what are you seeing? That sounds terrible. Gibbity skibbity. Oh no, Timmy caught the mean disease. You have to keep your ears covered and get out of there. What are you saying? I can't hear you. I got him. We live. <laughs> Come on. Memes are a very infectious disease. If you hear someone saying mean sounds, you must plug your ears and get out of there immediately or else you could be infected forever. <laughs> hey, babe. Today it's officially been 10 years since my brother Timmy died because of the meme disease. <laughs> It's been 10 years already? Huh? I said it's been 10 years already? Huh? I said it's been 10 years already? Huh? Huh? Oh no. You caught the meme disease. Huh? Come on, put on your headband. You need to cover your eye. It's time for school. No, I don't want to put it on. You have to wear it. People can't know you have a third eye. My third eye says you're cheating on daddy. Get over here. Ah! You must always keep your third eye covered because if the government finds out that you can see people's secrets, they'll try and take you away. <gasps> ho ho, headband head. Zip it, Jake. <laughs> headband head, what are you hiding under there? Brianna, are you okay? I'm fine. What's on your forehead that you're hiding? I'm your best friend and you've never even shown me. I'll show you, but you can't tell anyone about this, okay? I'm your best friend. You can trust me. Why do you have an eye on your head? I would hide that too. There's more. You've been seeing my boyfriend behind my back? You've been seeing my boyfriend behind my back? 
I would never. You're my best friend. I love you. You're a liar. You know what? Pretend you didn't see anything. You're not my best friend anymore. Come on, Bree. Babe, what's wrong? I need you to keep your eyes closed and not open them until I say so. What? Why? Just do it. Okay, I will. Sheesh. You're in love with my best friend. I'm not. What the? I told you to keep your eyes closed. Brianna, can I see your third eye? Who told you? Remove your headband and we'll tell you. I said who told you? It was Stephanie. Stephanie! Stephanie! You told everyone about my third eye. Bree, no. I didn't tell anyone. I promise. Makes sense why your dad never came back with the milk. How do you know? Wait, your eye has a special power, doesn't it? I now pronounce you husband and wife. If we're husband and wife, then we should kiss. Um, okay, I guess, Kimmy, but just on the cheek, okay? Okay, I guess. <laughs> I got money? Mommy, today at school, I got money. Oh, honey, you must have kissed someone. Every time you kiss someone, you get money. But it has to be someone new every time. If you kiss the same person, you won't get money. So that means I could be rich, but I don't want to kiss boys. That's gross. <laughs> Mom, are you feeling okay? Sweetie, it's cancer. The medical bills are going to be way too expensive, and I'm too sick to work. How am I going to pay the bills? Mom, don't worry. I'll get you enough money. Bestie, I need your help. I need to kiss as many boys as possible. Ew. It's for my mom. She needs the money. Oh, well, look over there. There's Eugene. He's a nerd. He'll kiss you for sure. Look over there. There's Eugene. He's a nerd. He'll kiss you for sure. Eugene, I need you to kiss me. I'll kiss you on one condition. You have to say Eugene is the smartest, hottest guy on the planet. I'm not saying that. You can just kiss me on the cheek if it's such a big deal. You do know you get way more money if you kiss someone on the lips, right? <laughs> Eugene is the smartest, hottest guy on the planet. Okay, now say it like you mean it. No, we had a deal. I said it. Now kiss me. Okay, don't yell at me. Yuck, why does it taste like feet? What I do in my spare time is none of your business. I got money. Now who can I kiss next? Principal Stevens, wait! Hey Brianna, your best friend told me you're trying to kiss as many boys as possible to get money for your mom. I'm down if you are. But Jason, you're my boyfriend's best friend and my boyfriend and I haven't even had our first kiss yet. Fine, if you don't want money for your mom. Fine, I'll do it. Jason, just please don't tell my boyfriend. Don't worry, he already knows. I can't wear these anymore. You have to smile, or I'm going to put the clothing pins back on, okay? Okay. Honey, you know I'm doing this because I love you, right? If you get caught not smiling, you'll be executed. Yeah. Me sissy walking. Ah! You made me fall. Oh, sorry, sissy. <laughs> I think I broke my leg. S sissy, <laughs> you're not smiling. We have a code red. Hurry. Smile. You look so beautiful when you smile, babe. Well, that's good because that's all we're allowed to do, so... My mother was just executed. Baby, you're not smiling. Smile. I can't believe she's gone. Baby, they're watching. Hurry up, smile. <coughs> Baby, smile. We've got a code red. Baby, they're watching. Hurry up, smile. <coughs> Baby, smile. We've got a code red. Okay, okay, I'm smiling, I'm smiling! Your smile's looking a little low today. Yeah, it is. We're going to have to use the clothing pins again. You need a much wider smile than that. Hey, Bree. Hey, Bestie, your smile's looking a little low. Here, try these clothing pins. It's a trick my mom taught me. You put it right here. What's even the point anymore? Bestie, you need to smile. I can't lose you, too. We've got a code red. I'm smiling. I'm smiling. We'll let you off with a warning. A warning? They never got a warning. I'm smiling. I'm smiling. We'll let you off with a warning. A warning? They never got a warning. My boyfriend, my best friend, my five-year-old sister. Your mother would be very upset you're acting this way. Mother. Yeah, the creator of the smiling law. She told us to show no mercy to her children, but I figured she'd be upset if both her daughters were gone. Mother. Where's your smile? 
You're the creator of the smiling law. Is that a problem, honey? Think of all the people that died because of you. Little sister, she was only five years old. And she didn't obey the law, and neither did you. Where are the police? You're a monster. Looks like I'm going to have to get rid of you myself. Come on, honey. You've already lost everyone. You really want to lose your mother, too? You're the only one I wanted to lose. You're so skibbity. You're so phantom tag. I just want to be your sigma. Be your sigma. Timmy, you can't copy what I just said. But I wanted that line. If you copy what someone just said or do an action that someone just did, you'll die. But I was supposed to sing that part of the song. <laughs> Jimmy stole my line. Bye, Grandma. I'm off to school now. I'll see you later. What did you say? I couldn't hear you. I can't find my hearing aids. I'll see you later. You're an alligator. No, I'll see you later. You're stuck in a radiator? I'll see you later. Oh, I'll see you later. <laughs> Grandma! Guess what? I found your hearing aids. They were... Oh, no. Bree, what's up, girl? Oh, I'll, I'll get, get it. it. Which one of us went to go pick it up first? It was definitely me. Stop copying me. Stop copying me. I wasn't. Yes, you were. Look, both of us are still alive, so that means neither of us were copying each other. We both went to pick it up at the same time. Yeah, I guess you're right. Anyways, I'm heading to class now. Bye. Bye. So close. Hey, Brianna, did you finish the homework? I totally forgot. Yeah, I did. Chad, are you copying my homework? Um, no. Well, I really hope you're telling the truth, because if you did just copy my homework, you're gonna die. I told you I did it! And that's why you should always do your homework. You tell him, Eugene. He can't hear you, he's dead. Good, now that everyone has their assignments, everyone must start their assignment at the exact same time so that no one is accused of copying someone else's actions. Three, two, one, begin. Oh, I'm getting so tired. Ooh! No, Brianna, don't yawn. Mommy, can I have a lollipop? No, sweetie, no sweets for you. <coughs> Honey, stop pouting. You need to smile right now. It's the new beauty standard. You need to, or else bye-bye from Earth. Good job. Keep smiling. Mommy, can I stop smiling now? My mouth is hurting from smiling so much. That's too bad. You still need to keep smiling. Why do I even need to fit the beauty standard? I'm only a kid. Use your hands and turn that frown upside down. <gasps> oh no, I need to get big lips right away. I already have big lips. There, beautiful. Wow, your lips look so big. Are you kidding me? There, no lips. Sophie, why do you still have big lips? What? The beauty standard changed. Someone doesn't fit the beauty standard. No, my lips aren't this big. It's just makeup. Prove it now or else. I can't. <gasps> so big. Was that concealer I saw in your hand earlier? Mom. Use this makeup wipe and prove there's no makeup on your lips. Show me now. You're good to go. You didn't even need concealer. Your lips are extremely thin. Thank you. I think. <laughs> the beauty standard changed again. There. Lots of freckles. <laughs> Timmy, are you okay? Why are you hiding in a corner? Shh, I don't want them to find me. I don't have freckles. Don't worry, Timmy. I can help you get freckles. Oh, look. Little Timmy doesn't fit the beauty standard. Brother, this is all your fault! <gasps> Timmy, no! Huh? Class, I think you all know what you need to do. This is the most painless option you have. Where's your mouth? You actually got rid of it? Mm, 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 mm. The beauty standard changed again. Being young, what's gonna happen to all the old people? Our teachers, our parents, our grandparents? Mm, 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 mm. I need to call my mom. Mom, whatever you do, don't go out. You need to stay in the house and hide, okay? Until the beauty standard changes. Okay, sweetie. I love you. I love you. Looks like I found an oldie. I'm not old, I'm 17. That's what they all say. Here, my ID. Oh wow, you look at least 24. 
Get to class, Brittany. Uh -uh. Mrs. Smith, you need to hide. Did you not see the beauty standard changed? Oh, no, I didn't even notice. No eyes? Here, Brianna. This should help you with that. What do you want me to do with this? You know exactly what you have to do to fit the beauty standard. After you. All right, I'll go first. But if you don't do it, I'll call the beauty police. <laughs> you wouldn't. Beauty! Ah! I can't see where I'm going. Uh -uh. Oh. Brittany, what happened to your eyes? Do you think that anyone actually finds these things beautiful? Or are all these beauty standards just for control? Oh, thank goodness. Oh, no. Come on, Mom. Pick up, pick up. Mom, I'm calling because this might be the last time you'll ever hear from me. I'm dressed up as an elderly woman right now, but I might get caught. I just want you to know that I love you so, so, so much. Bold of you to assume that your mom will ever get your message. These beauty standards are getting insane. I know they are, because I'm the one creating them. What? You know how many people are gone because of you? How many people you hurt? And what about me? What about the people who hurt me? Sorry? Do you want to know why I created these beauty standards? It was all for a little girl who never fit them. My skin wasn't clear enough. My eyes couldn't see well enough, my lips weren't big enough, and my hair wasn't shiny enough. And because of that, I was made fun of. She has no lips! How will she get a kiss kiss? No kiss for her! <laughs> Hi. Sorry, this table is only for girls who meet the beauty standard. No nerds. I'm not a nerd just because I wear glasses. Too bad, you're still not pretty enough to sit with us. <laughs> When I got older, I started working for the government. They were looking for new ways for population control. So I suggested that everyone must always fit the current beauty standard, or else. And because the beauty standard is always changing, no one can ever fit it, and beauty becomes meaningless. Someone here looks very young. It's that young lady right there! You guys really think I look young? I mean... Even though she makes the beauty standards, she can still go bye-bye? Say bye-bye. Wait, look! The beauty standard changed again! <laughs> There. Beautiful. Huh. <laughs> nice makeup. Thanks! Hey, wait. Could I get your help with something? Hey, Mrs. Smith, I love your makeup. What do you want now? You know, I'm surprised people used to make fun of you for not being beautiful. I always thought you were beautiful. Really? You did? Yeah, I really did. But you know what? You look even more beautiful without makeup. Here, let me see your natural beauty. What do you think? Do I really look beautiful? You do. The people who used to make fun of you were so wrong. You don't fit the beauty standard. That was a good idea you had. I was getting sick of her. Well, you're in charge now. What will the next beauty standard be? I know exactly what I want it to be. Everyone's beautiful. Nice. Bombastic blank. Criminal offensive blank. Oh no, Timmy, did you just get a TikTok saying? Answer it carefully, because if you answer it wrong, you die. Bombastic... Um... Timmy, look, I'm giving you a hint! Oh, bombastic eyebrow. Criminal offensive eyebrow. No, no, no! It was bombastic side eye. Only in blank. Only in Ohio. Bye, Grandma, I'm off to school now. I just got a TikTok saying. Grandma, it's TikTok. Double it and blank it to the next blank. I don't know, I don't use TikTok. You have to try or they'll kill you. Double it and throw it at your grandpa. <laughs> Grammy! Why are you still here? You're going to be late. Mom, Grammy's gone. Oh no, what happened? She got a TikTok saying and she didn't guess it right. It wasn't her fault. She doesn't know how to use the internet. I just got a TikTok saying. I just got a TikTok saying. Trying the new blank shake. The what shake? Mom, I don't know the answer. I'll give you a hint. It was someone's birthday. Trying the new Grimace shake. I got it. Where did you just go? Go? I didn't go anywhere. I was here the whole time. You're losing it, Mom. Hey, how's my best friend doing today? Not good. My grandma passed away this morning. Oh, no. I just got a TikTok saying. Hurry, Bethy, read it. B-F-F-R. Be blank for real. I know the answer, but I can't say it. It's a bad word. No! Mmm, yummy lunch. I just got a TikTok saying. Hurry, Eugene, read it. 
Eight and left no blank. Hmm. <gasps> eight and left no. Eight and left no bread. The answer is eight and left no bread. No, it was crumbs. Why would it be eight and left no bread? Miss Blank has blank. Miss Rabbit has fainted. Babe, babe, I was calling you. I'm sorry, babe. I'm a little out of it today. It just feels like everyone around me keeps dying. I just got a TikTok saying, Mother Blank Blank. I'll give you a hint. It's a game. Someone made a POV about this, right? Yes, a beautiful, amazing, perfect model blonde girl made a POV about it. I don't remember her being all that. Anyways, I know the answer. It's Mother Can I. No, it was Mother May I. Hey, Brianna. Jake, stay away from me. I think I'm cursed. Everyone around me keeps dying. Eat these hot peppers and I'll give you $20. Deal. Go, Brianna, go. Ooh, okay. It's got a little kick. Go, Brianna, go. Ooh, okay. It's got a little kick. Light work, blank, blank. Ah, these peppers are so spicy. Brianna, this is perfect. How? This TikTok saying has to do with eating spicy food. Light work, no reaction. I got it. Oh, no, I just got a TikTok saying. Hurry, Jake, read it. Rate blank on a scale from blank to blank. Rate me on a scale from 1 to 10. Probably a 4 at best. No, that was the answer. Oh. Brianna, I think now is a good time to tell you. I don't like you just as a friend. I love you. I never told you before because I know you have a boyfriend, but I can't hide it anymore. Jake, I don't have a boyfriend anymore. He died playing finish the TikTok saying. I just got a TikTok saying. I just got a TikTok saying. He is not the blank of your blank. Hit him with your blank. I have no clue what this one could be. He is not the love of your life. Hit him with your car. Whoa, you got it. I confessed my feelings to you earlier. You never gave me an answer. Jake, I don't feel the same way. My boyfriend just passed away. I'm not ready to open up my heart to someone like that. I just got a TikTok saying, this is so blank and blank. I don't need a hint. This is so sick and twisted. Jake, wait, don't be mad at me. Wait. I just got a TikTok saying, that was my blank reason. It's the number that comes after 11. That was my 12th reason. I got it wrong. <laughs> you gave me the wrong hint on purpose. That's what you get for rejecting me. Wait, how are you still alive? You can't kill the creator of the game, Jake. Hi, Mom, I'm going to... Okay, have fun at... There's my, it's my, I love, I love, you're truly the love of my, you're so, stop it, babe, you're so, <laughs> I'll see you after class, baby. You can't finish your, oh no, I forgot, <laughs> no, he was the love of my, Brianna, what's the answer to, the answer's correct, the answer was, Class, it's time to write your... Timmy, can I board your... Sure, here's my... No, your... Oh, here's my... Is that what you... No, your... What are you trying to... Pencil! You can't just say one. They'll consider it a full... <gasps> Mommy, why do I have a heart on my hand? Oh, you got it. That's your color-changing heart. When your heart is white, it means no one is currently in love with you. When your heart turns red, it means someone is in love with you. But if your heart turns black, it means their love for you is dead. Hey, baby, I got you this rose. It's beautiful, just like you. Oh, would you look at that? My heart's still red. Someone's in love with me. Good morning, Bree. Hey, girl. Is everything okay with you and Derek? Yeah, why? Your heart turned black. Are you painting your heart red? Yeah, my boyfriend fell out of love with me, so I'm going to keep painting it red until he loves me again. If he was the one, he wouldn't have stopped loving you. Honey, are you home? Yeah, mom, I'm home. How do you get red paint off your hand? Check your heart status. Maybe your heart's actually red. Honey, are you home? Yeah, mom, I'm home. How do you get red paint off your hand? Check your heart status. Maybe your heart's actually red. By that reaction, your heart must be red. It was black earlier. That means Derek loves me again. How do you know it's Derek? Who else would it be? It has to be Derek. 
<laughs> Derek, you are so funny. Well, you know. Hi, Derek. Oh, hey, Brianna. I'm really busy right now. Can we talk later? Oh, okay. Are you still painting your heart red? No. Derek loves me again. Wow, that was fast. Lucky you. Oh my gosh, my heart turned red. Do you think Derek loves you? I hope so. Brianna, your heart's red again. Looks like Derek does love you. No, I don't think it's Derek. I know who's in love with you. It's... Brianna, your heart's red again. Looks like Derek does love you. No, I don't think it's Derek. I know who it is. It's me. I'm sorry, but I don't think I feel the same way. Come on, give him a chance. Love doesn't always happen right away. Hey, baby, my heart's still black. We've been dating for a week and you still don't love me? You need to give it some time. We've only been dating for a week. Love doesn't always happen right away. But I do like you. I'll wait, as long as it takes. Hello? Hi, Brianna, this is James' mother. James is in the hospital now. He was in a tragic accident. He might not make it. I'm on my way. James, stay with me. Hello? My baby. Is James okay? Is he still breathing? He's gone, but his heart turned red. Because I love him. Mommy, did you want us any food today? No, I lost again. What about Sissy? Did she play? I did, but I lost. Unfortunately, we can only play in the Hunger Games. Let her try and win some food. I'll come with her. But be careful. People are very hostile when they're hungry. I'm here to- I got family to feed. I'm not losing. Miss Turner. You better watch rock, rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. I chose paper. Thank you, guys. I got 10 kids to feed. <laughs> Sissy, close your eyes. Here, give me the food. I'll hold it for you. Why would you do that? That was my sister. I'm Mommy, did you want to send me? Do I want to eat this cookie or this cookie? Hmm. Hurry up and choose. If you don't make a decision before the timer runs out, you'll be eliminated. Okay, I want this cookie. Wait, no. Do I want this cookie? Hurry up and choose! Okay, I choose this cookie. I Heading to school already? Yeah, Mom. What'd you bring for lunch? Oh, no, I forgot. Well, you better go grab something for lunch before you go. Well, what do we have? We have leftover potato salad from last night, or you could make a sandwich. Hmm. Decide now or you'll be eliminated! Okay, I'll choose the sandwich then. Good choice. Hey, Bree. Hi, Timmy. I have a lollipop for you. Hmm, which one should I give you? Blue or pink? Blue or pink? Blue or... Just give me the pink one! Okay, here! Thank you. Brianna, I'm in love with you. I've been wanting to tell you for a long time and... Brianna, no! I'm in love with you! No, Jimmy, I was in love with her first! Well, Brianna, who are you gonna choose? Who do I choose, Timmy or Jimmy? I love you more than Jimmy! No, I do! Ah! Come on, Brianna, decide! Decide! Okay, I choose Jimmy! Ha! Take that, Jimmy! You're not even that pretty, so I don't care. And you smell bad! Do I want Jimmy, though? I want Jimmy, I want Jimmy. Exactly, because I'm the man. So, Jimmy, where should we go for our first date? I'm not sure. How about you give me some choices? Well, we could go to the mall, arcade, out to dinner, out for breakfast, bowling, horseback riding. We could go skydiving. We could go on a walk. We could go on a hike. We could go on a run. We could go for ice cream. Silence! I can't decide now. You gave me too many options. <laughs> Jimmy, no! Bree, are you okay? Jimmy's gone. No, Jimmy! How did that happen? What happened to Jimmy? He couldn't make a decision, so now he's gone, okay? Why did a decision just appear above my head? Oh, you didn't know? They're doing automated decisions for you to make now. It'll help speed up population control. What decision do you have to make? Brianna? Mmm, yummy pepper. I like lots of pepper on my food. Brianna? Die! Uh, I'm gonna sneeze. No, Jimmy! <laughs> Why did you say that? I was distracting you from sneezing, and it worked. It's just a COVID cold. Nothing serious. Well, what are you doing here? Are you trying to kill I, I don't believe you. Uh, I just... Stay back. Stay. Oh, no. I'm going to sneeze. Mmm, yummy pepper. I like lots of pepper on my food. Brian. Die. Uh, I'm going to sneeze. No. Mmm, yummy pepper. I like lots of pepper on my food. Brian. Die. A potato, pass it on! I don't want this potato, it's ugly! You have to pass it on before the timer runs out or else you die! <gasps> Hello, little girl. Here, random guy, have a potato! Thank you, I am so hungry. 
Hot potato pass it on! Seriously, Derek! Where is everyone? Sophie, hot potato pass it on! Why would you give me the potato? I'm your best friend! Timmy, hot potato pass it on! Are you kidding me right now? I'm glad you're safe, Sophie. Yeah, no thanks to you. How could you pass me the potato? I thought we were best friends. I was scared. I couldn't find anyone else to pass it to. We're not best friends anymore. Don't talk to me ever again. Sophie, don't do this. Goodbye. Sophie! Oh, no. Oh, no. <gasps> Everyone run! She has the potato! Come on, guys! Jimmy, hot potato, pass it on! Oh! Whoa, 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 I'm gonna drop it! No, Jimmy, if you drop the potato after touching it, you die! I dropped it! Come on, Jimmy! Hey, Sophie, wait. Are you really just never going to speak to me again? Hot potato, pass it on. Hot potato, pass it on! Hot potato, pass it on! No, you pass it on! No, you! No, you! Pass on the potato! Hot potato, pass it on! Pass on the hot potato! Pass it on, Sophie! Pass it on! Ouch! This assignment's so hard. Could you help me, Brianna? <laughs> Anything for you, Jake. Oh, mother Mmm, yummy pepper. I like vodka pepper on my food. Brianna. Uh, I'm gonna sneeze. No, Jimmy, no! Jimmy, why did you say that? I was distracting you from sneezing, and it worked. It's just a COVID cold. Nothing serious. Well, what are you doing here? Are you trying to kill... I don't believe you. Uh, I... Stay back. Jesse! Oh, no. I'm gonna sneeze. Mmm, yummy pepper. I like lots of pepper on my food. Brianna. Yeah. Die! Uh, I'm gonna sneeze. Yummy pepper. I like lots of pepper on my food. Brienne. Die! Meow, meow. Oh no, she only has one brain cell today. That's not enough. How is she going to survive? <laughs> Here, honey, eat this. It's breakfast. Hot. She can't go through the day with only one brain cell. I know what to do. I was gifted a special chocolate that increases brain cells. Honey, eat this right away. Kitchen. No, sweetie, that's chocolate. You need to eat it. So close, sweetie, but a bit lower. Yes. And take a bite. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. I just read that entire book in three seconds. Honey, she has infinite brain cells. All right, guardians, I'm off to school. No need to walk me. I know the way. Class, what's three plus two? The answer's five, miss. What is this, baby class? Are we in baby school? This is kindergarten, but you're too smart for kindergarten. You'll have to go to high school. The leader for today. Everyone, they're choosing the leader for today. I hope it's me. <laughs> it's me. That means you all have to follow what I do or you die. Timmy, you'll be a good leader, right? You won't make anyone do anything terrible. <laughs> Begin your exam. Oh, I don't want to write my exam. Everyone, take your exam paper, crumple it up, and throw it in the garbage. No, no, I need straight A's. I have to write this exam. Eugene, you have to follow whatever the leader does or you'll die. No, I have to get into Harvard. I have to write. Everyone stop. We're doing 100 jumping jacks. Timmy, why? One, two. 100. Timmy, that was a lot of jumping jacks. Maybe we should all drink water. No, there's no time for that. We're going to rob a bank. They're changing the leader. 100. Timmy, that was a lot of jumping jacks. Maybe we should all drink water. No, there's no time for that. We're going to rob a bank. They're changing the leader. The new leader. No way. I'm the new leader. Everyone, let's touch the top of the lockers. Kayla, no. You know I'm too short to reach the top of a locker. Exactly, Timmy. You're the reason Eugene's dead. He was the love of my life. Now this is what you get. Kayla, no! Everyone, we can all put our arms down now. Now, who am I going to get revenge on next? I know you're hurt, but another person dying isn't going to take away your pain. Looks like you're next, Brianna. Everyone, we're going to cut off a chunk of our hair. What? No, I love my hair! You must do as the leader does. Everyone, we're going to cut off a chunk of our hair. 
What? No, I love my hair. You must do as the leader does. Wait. I'm going to choose a piece from the back. Hurry up. Okay. <laughs> I really didn't think you'd actually do it, Brianna. They're changing the leader. The new leader. No. It's me. So, leader, what are we doing now? Right, I'm the leader. Okay, everyone, we're going to drink some Perrier water, and then we're going to have lunch. Everyone, for lunch, we are eating a peanut butter wrap. Brianna, no, I'm deathly allergic to peanuts. Kayla, you have to do as the leader does or they'll kill you. But if I eat peanut butter, I'll die. You have to try. Are you off to school now? Yes, I mean, no, not yet. Sissy, are you ready for school yet? Maybe. Sissy, you need to answer my question correctly or else you'll be eliminated. Okay, fine. I'm not ready yet. Stay safe today, okay, sweetie? Remember, whenever you're asked a question, you must answer it correctly and within 10 seconds. Okay, Mom, I understand. Mom, where's my backpack? Um, I'm not sure. Sissy, you can't ask someone a question they don't know the answer to. Where is it? I can't find your backpack anywhere. I'm sorry. I thought Mommy would know. Your backpack is behind the couch. <sighs> Yay, Mommy's safe. She's safe, but don't ever do that again, okay? Okay. Here's your assignment. Now remember, class, put your name and the date at the top of the paper. Psst, Timmy, what day is it today? Oh, uh, oh, uh, I don't remember. What's wrong with you? Why would you ask me a question? Come on, Timmy. I'm sure you know what day it is. You just need to think a little harder. I don't! Mommy, why whenever I hold onto an object, it says send to soulmate? That's because, honey, any object you touch, you can send to your soulmate, and he can send you any object he touches. I'm going to send him Mr. Octopus. <gasps> Mommy, my soulmate wants to send me something. What did he do to my octopus? And why is there a puzzle piece with an H on it? Oh, honey. I'm never letting my soulmate send me anything ever again. And I'm never sending him anything. My soulmate sent me flowers. Oh, that's so sweet. Did your soulmate send you anything today? No, I haven't accepted anything from my soulmate since I was six. You should accept it. It might be something important. Yeah. A puzzle piece with an E on it. Oh, my soulmate's trying to send me something again. LP? He sent me E earlier. Maybe he's trying to say something. Yeah, like Lep or L. Pell. And why is there a puzzle piece with an H on it? My soulmate was trying to say that he needs help. What am I going to do? You should send him over something so he can protect himself. Good idea. Here, send him this frying pan. Now you're talking. My soulmate's trying to send me something. He sent me the frying pan back. He must not need it. Brianna, look, he attached something. It's a puzzle piece with the one on it. I wonder what this one could mean. My soulmate's trying to send me something. Four, three. Maybe he's trying to tell me what address he's at. Or maybe it's a code to unlock something. Sophie, I'm worried about my soulmate. He hasn't sent me anything in hours. What if something happened to him? Here, send him this. Oh, moldy cheese? It smells so bad that if someone's holding him captive, they'll release him for sure. Why do you have this on hand? You don't? Maybe I can send over myself. I don't know. I don't think you're considered an object. I can send myself, but I'm scared. I don't know where I'm going to end up. It's not a good idea. It's too dangerous. Please, don't go. My soulmate wants to send me something. A six. He wants to send me something again. What is it? It's an arrow, but I can't tell if it's up or down. Attach it to the puzzle piece and see. It's down. He sent me dirt. This is getting weird. I need to go to him. Brianna, wait. Take this for protection. Promise me you'll come back safely. I promise I will. Why am I at a graveyard? Six down. I think he was trying to say he's six feet under. Help, help me. Are you still alive? What's on my neck? One, one, six, one. Sissy! Sissy, did you draw on my neck last night while I was sleeping? No, I didn't. Liar! That's your elimination number. Elimination number? 
It's for population control. How it works is someone is randomly given three numbers above their head and they must choose one to eliminate. Everyone will keep on choosing numbers until the desired population is reached. Well, you guys need to show me your numbers then so I don't choose you by mistake. Two, two, three, four. Eight, six, three, one. Two, two, three, four. And eight, six, three, one. Got it. I'll make sure not to choose those. Sweetie, is everything okay? It's my turn to eliminate a number. What numbers did you get? It's both of your numbers and some random number. Five, six, seven, eight. I'll just choose that one. Hey, Jenny, where's Jake? I miss my boyfriend. He was eliminated this morning. Oh, no. Once I find out who chose five, six, seven, eight and eliminated my brother, they're going to be eliminated next. Why did you seem so shocked after hearing that number? No reason. I'm just so shocked that my boyfriend's gone from me so soon. And why are you covering your neck? Oh, it's nothing. My neck is just a little cold. You're acting really guilty right now, Brianna. Oh, would you look at that? It's my turn to eliminate a number. My options are 8631. That's little sissy. 1161. 4632. Yeah, my number's 4632. So don't choose that one, okay? Prove it to me. Show me your neck so I won't choose that one. I just want to be sure. No, I don't really see the need for that. They're doing two number eliminations at once? What numbers did they give you? 1678 3214 5787. Oh no. Are any of those your numbers? Uh, maybe. Well, you should probably stop hiding your numbers so that I don't accidentally choose it. Fine, we'll show each other our numbers at the same time. Ready? Mr. Strawberry, I love. Stop. Don't say I love you. Honey, it's time you know. When you say I love you to someone who doesn't love you back, you'll lose all your memory. That's why I only say I love you to daddy and my children because they're the ones I know that love me back. Good morning, mom. Who are you? Where am I? What am I doing here? What is this place? Mom, do you remember anything? I'm your mom. You lost your memory. Dad, dad, something's going on with mom. She doesn't remember anything. Did she say I love you to anyone? Yeah, uh, to me, last night. I'm sorry, but I lost feelings for your mother. So it's your fault. You don't love mom anymore and she lost her memory? It's not what I intended to happen. Truthfully, I met another woman. But don't worry, I love you, you're my daughter. Where am I? Who are you? Who am I? Dad? I love you, you're my daughter. Where am I? Who are you? Who am I? Dad? Dad, you lost your memory? That means I don't love- Open up, we're the memory police. The memory police are here? Who's that? Mom! Mom, please, you have to remember something. The memory police are here. I'm your mom? Yes, that's all you have to say. Open up! The door's open. Come in. Are all memories intact here? Of course. Who are you? I'm your mom. See? What is this place? I don't know where I am. We've got a memory loss. Take him away. Goodbye, Dad. Mom, I have to go to school now. Just stay safe and don't do anything until I come home. I love... No, I can't say it. Of course you wouldn't love me. I'm a stranger to you. I love... I love you. How do you know that word? Babe, there you are. I think it's time we say the L word. No, I don't want to say it. I've already lost someone because of that word. Don't worry, you don't have to say it. I'll say it. I love... No, don't say it! I don't... I love you. Who are you? Where am I? I'm scared. We've got a memory loss. Take him away. It's mom. Mom? Mom? She has no memory left. How would she know how to use a phone? Did you just say your mom has no memory? How is she not taken away yet? No. She has her memory. I was just joking. Mom, mom, I came running back from school. Is everything okay? Are you okay? I'm your mom? I think you called by mistake. Memory police, open up. Come in. We're taking your mother. No, no, you can't. She's all I have. Take me with her. Your memories are intact. I love you. Can you give me a foot massage? Oh, no. Grandma, I really wish I could, but I really gotta get to school. Oh, no. I am always on the dinner table, but you don't get to eat me. What am I? Grandma, you have three tries to guess it right, or else... This is an easy one. Feet. <laughs> No, Grandma, your feet should never be on the table. My dad jerk. No, Grandma, it's something you put food on. My hand. Thank goodness she's gone. She was giving me a headache. Grandpa, 
How could you say that about grandma? I live in the ocean. I can live for a very long time. I'm a very large mammal. What am I? A large mammal? That's your grandma. Grandpa. <laughs> a dolphin? A shark? A whale? I got it. You sure it wasn't your grandma? <laughs> grandpa. I have two hands, but I cannot scratch myself. What am I? <laughs> your grandmother. Oh, how rude of me. Would you like some, Sophie? No. Put a finger down if you've ever stole. Sophie, you put a finger down you've stolen before? I have. I only have one finger left. That's not good, Sophie. If you lose all your fingers, you'll get eliminated. Put a finger down if you're cringe. <clears throat> That's not me. I'm not putting a finger down. Brianna, if you lie, you'll be eliminated. Put a finger down if you've ever committed tax fraud. Sophie, you've committed tax fraud? You're six years old. It's a cruel world we live in. Sophie! It's a cruel, cruel world we live in. Hi, Bay. I got you this. Oh, it's so cute. Put a finger down if you like men. <laughs> well, obviously I do. Babe, why'd you put a finger down? You don't like men. <laughs> True. Babe! Baby! Babe, why'd you put a finger down? You don't like men. <laughs> True. Babe! Baby! Put a finger down if your boyfriend just got eliminated from the game. That seems a little specific. Put a finger down if you're wearing a black shirt with gold hoop earrings and a necklace with a gem in the middle. Okay, what the flip? Psst, Timmy. Timmy! Ouch! I think the game is trying to eliminate me. Why? Because you're only saying things that are specific to me. Put a finger down if you're looking at Timmy right now and just spoke to him over three seconds ago. See? A lot of people look at me and speak to me, so... Look, and now I don't have a hand. Put a finger down if you're wearing pink lipstick. That's it. Brianna, what are you doing? I don't have to put a finger down if what they're saying isn't true. Put a finger down if you have two eyebrows. I need to shave my eyebrows. <coughs> put a finger down if you have two eyebrows. I need to shave my eyebrows. <coughs> I did it. Oh, oh, who's this ugly girl with no eyebrows? Timmy, stop screaming! It's me, Brianna! Oh, thank goodness. I thought you were an alien. Why didn't you shave your eyebrows? Because I didn't need to. I just put a finger down. I still have eight fingers left, unlike you, who only has five. Put a finger down if you have a crush on Timmy. Oh, wow, I wonder who has a crush on Brianna? Unfortunately, this put a finger down is impossible to make untrue. You actually have a crush on me? I do, but it doesn't matter. I'm not going to live much longer. The game won't stop until I'm eliminated. Put a finger down if you've never had your first kiss. I have to kiss you, Timmy. Gross! I saw fireworks. I saw saliva. Put a finger down if Brianna Guidry is alive. Uh-oh. What? You're going to become a target. Everyone's going to try and eliminate you so they don't have to put a finger down. You need to get... Hey, Bri. You need to get... Hey, Bri. Jimmy, no. Please don't do this. <laughs> Brianna, stay back! Jimmy! Take this, Jimmy! Ow! I think I'm safe here. Put a finger down if you're wearing shoes. Put a finger down if you're wearing socks. Ugh. Put a finger down if you have two eyeballs. Fine, you got me. Put a finger down if you have two fingers left. Look, if you wanted to eliminate me, you should have just did it. What's the point of me playing put a finger down? Good work, Timmy. She's almost eliminated. We make a good team. Timmy, you're alive. Isn't it amazing what a bulletproof vest and red food coloring can do? We run this game. Put a finger down if you lost. Mommy, why do I always have to wear this blindfold? The kids at school make fun of me. You were born with a curse. If you make eye contact with someone, They'll die. <gasps> you can take off your blindfold, but you must promise me you'll never make eye contact with anyone. Okay, mommy. I promise. I'm not making eye contact. 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 Good job. <laughs> oh, no. Mommy! What happened to your mother? Daddy, I made a mistake. I made eye contact with mommy. No! Look, it's deadly eye contact, girl. No one go near her. She killed her own parents when she was six. Ah! Ah, she just tried to 
to kill me. She tried to make eye contact with me. I wasn't trying to make eye contact with you. I was looking at the floor. You okay, baby? Yeah, just keep her away from me. You again. Don't try and make eye contact with me. I'm not. Just go ahead. Go down the stairs first. I am. Don't follow me. We're making eye contact. <laughs> Everyone, here are your soulmate heart lockets. Only your soulmate will have the key to your heart. And only you will have the key to their heart. Jake is going to be your soulmate for sure. You guys are made for each other. You guys really think so? Hey, Brianna, do you think I could see if we're soulmates? Ew, nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Imagine your soulmate is nerdy Nathan. <laughs> no, Nathan, there's no way you're my soulmate. You're a nerd. That was a little harsh. Here's your test back, Brianna. No way, you got 100%. You're smart. No. Brianna, are you a nerd now? You should quit cheerleading and join the chess club with nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Nathan. Jake, it's time to see if we have the key to each other's hearts. I really hope you're my soulmate. You're the hottest girl in the school. And what else? That's it, you're hot. Nothing else matters, babe. I guess. Does it fit? It... Does it fit? It doesn't. You're not my soulmate, Jake. So what? Who cares about a soulmate? That soulmate stuff is fake anyways. We're still gonna be together, right? We're both the hottest and most popular people in the school. Yeah. Of course. So, are you and Jake soulmates? We're not. No way, but you guys were made for each other. But, we're still gonna be together. Yay! You two are the perfect couple. Jake, why don't you break up with Brianna and just be with me? No way. She's way harder than you. You're just my side girlfriend. Why am I not even surprised? You deserve so much better than him. Just mind your business, nerdy Nathan. Hey, Nathan. I'm sorry I yelled at you earlier. I was just really hurt. I'm used to it. Someone dropped their heart key. It unlocks my heart. Ew, Grandma! No, don't kiss her! Anyone who gets kissed by someone who isn't their soulmate gets a permanent kiss mark! I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. Look at that chubby little face. Hey! Wait a minute. That means I'm going to have this kiss mark on my face forever? Look at Brittany. She has so many kiss marks. Wow, that has to be at least 300 kiss marks. She is for the streets. You gotta be careful with who you let kiss you, because if too many people kiss you that aren't your soulmate, you'll end up like Britney. Baby, I think we should have our first kiss today. Yeah, we should totally have our first kiss today, but uh, maybe later, because I didn't brush my teeth this morning. I have really bad morning breath. <gasps> Gross. What are you drinking? Pickle juice. It is so garlicky. You probably don't want to kiss me right now. I see what you're doing. If you didn't want to kiss me, you could have just said so. Jason, wait. Jason, I want to kiss you. I'm just scared. I don't want to get another kiss mark if you're not my soulmate. Brianna, I love you, and I truly believe that you're my soulmate. I'm willing to take the risk if you are. I am. Hi. Hi. Good morning. Morning. Bye. Bye, Mom. Hi, Bree. Hi, Timmy. How was your morning? I had the worst morning ever. When I woke up this morning, I fell down the stairs. Then I went to pour my cereal Timmy, and... stop. No, you need to hear this. I forgot the bowl. I poured milk and cereal all over my kitchen table. Yapping disease! And then I... Hi. Brianna? You okay? Timmy's gone. What happened? Yapping disease. I can't believe my brother caught the yapping disease. You know it's crazy because just this morning he was fine. And now all of a sudden he's gone and all yapping the memories... Disease. Why aren't you in class? I'm sorry, sir. Just something happened to Timmy and I was really sad and I'm scared because Jimmy... Uh-oh. Hey, Timmy, what am I doing? Bombastic side eye! Jinx, you owe me a soda! <laughs> Timmy! Poor Timmy. He wasn't fast enough. What happened? When you say something at the same time as someone else, the first person to say Jinx survives. If neither of you say it, you both live. But to be safe, I would say it. Good, Good morning. morning! Mom. I'm not going to say it. I know that neither of us would ever say that word to each other. Yeah, you're one of the only people I can trust that would never say that word to me. I love you, Mom. Have a good day. Morning, girl. Sophie, look at my new ring. Who got it for you? Jake. Jake. Uh, I'm not... Jinx! Why would you do that? I wasn't going to say the word. I just... I wasn't sure. Class, what's the answer to number three? 24. 24. Uh, sure. Class, what's the answer to number three? 24. 24. Uh, sure.
Jinx! Oh, why would you? <laughs> ah, Eugene, look what you did, Brianna. Class, I think it would be best if we all just go take a break for a few minutes. What's wrong with you? Why would you use that word? I was only going to say it because he was going to say it first. Yeah, sure he was. You're the worst, Brianna. <laughs> My boyfriend hasn't been answering his phone all day. Why are you looking extra handsome today, Jakey? Shh, not here. My girlfriend could be around. She's not here. I saw her. She went back to class. Good. Jake! Brianna, I, I can explain. Wait, it's, it's not, not what, what it looks, looks like. like. Jinx. That's what they all say. You men are so predictable. Oh, Jake, what have you done, Brianna? I didn't mean to do that. Oh, Jake, what have you done, Brianna? I didn't mean to do that. First Eugene and now Jake? Who's next? I didn't mean, mean to. to. Jinx. 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 I said it first. No, I definitely did. No. Jinx. Jinx. It's a tie. It's a tie. Okay, how about we agree that neither of us will say the word? Yeah. Jinx! Jinx! Another tie. Is this going to be a competition of who can say it first? I guess it is. Jinx! Jinx! You're never gonna win, Brianna. Brianna. Brittany. You can go first. After, After you. you. Jinx! 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 Look at Brianna over there. She said the J word to her own boyfriend. No way. I saw it with my own two eyes. It never would have happened, Brittany, if you didn't kiss my boyfriend. Oh, honey, we were seeing each other for months behind your back. That's just the first time we got caught. Jinx. We were seeing each other for months behind your back. That's just the first time we got caught. Jinx. No! <laughs> no, Brittany, my baby! You were her boyfriend? I was. She was cheating on you, by the way. So was I. I'm looking for Brianna. She's right over there. I'm gonna need you to come with me. Uh-oh, someone's in trouble. Did I do something wrong, officer? We received an anonymous call from a student. They said you're making your jinx count go up on purpose. No, I would never. This is all just some terrible coincidence. Don't worry. We just want to ask, ask you, you some, some questions. questions. Jinx! Who are you? I'm Jimmy. Jimmy? Timmy's brother. I lost my brother when I was seven because of you. Bombastic side eye! Jinx, you owe me a soda! <laughs> I remember. Jimmy, listen. I didn't, didn't do, do it, it on, on purpose. purpose. Jimmy, listen. I didn't, didn't do, do it on purpose. J Jimmy, don't say it. I'm not going to say Jinx either. I feel bad about what happened to Timmy. You literally just said it. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Jimmy. Hey, kid, I know that you jinxed the other officer. I saw it all in the security footage. Stop, Stop right, right there. there. Jinx! Where do you think you're going? Let go of me! You stay right there. You're in big trouble, young, young lady. lady. Jinx, I knew you were going to say that. Hey, Mom, I'm coming home early. Sweetie, what have you done? The police are here looking for you. Mom, everything's gone out of hand. I kept talking at the same time as people, and then I said the J word because I was afraid, and then the officers came, and I said it on purpose because I was scared they were going to take me away. Jinx. Good, Good morning. morning. Mom. I'm not going to say it. I know that neither of us would ever say that word to each other. Goodbye, sweetie. Mommy, I can't wait for the day that I find my soulmate. Darling, I wouldn't be too excited if I were you. You were born with a curse. Once you meet your soulmate, you stop aging forever. What? Oh, I'm so late. Dude, you just ran right into me. I'm sorry, I'm so late. I gotta go. 
my head. I can't believe that guy just ran into you. Here, you drop these. Thanks. Who bumps into a person and runs off? I know. I'm John, by the way. Do you think I could get your number? Sure. Happy 30th birthday! You don't look a day over 17. You really do still look 17, darling. You need to start aging. I don't want people to think I'm married to a teenager. <laughs> Happy 40th birthday! You haven't aged one bit. You haven't aged at all since we started dating. It's starting to scare me. John, I have to tell you something. What did you need to tell me? I think you're my soulmate, John. That's great, honey. But that means I can't grow old with you. Mommy, I can't wait for the day that I find my soulmate. Darling, I wouldn't be too excited if I were you. You were born with a curse. Once you meet your soulmate, you stop aging forever. What? Oh, I'm so late. <laughs> Dude, you just ran right into me. I'm sorry, I'm so late. I gotta go. My head. I can't believe that guy just ran into you. Here, you drop these. Thanks. Who bumps into a person and runs off? I know. I'm John, by the way. Do you think I could get your number? Sure. Happy 30th birthday! You don't look a day over 17. You really do still look 17, darling. You need to start aging. I don't want people to think I'm married to a teenager. <laughs> Happy 40th birthday! You haven't aged one bit. You haven't aged at all since we started dating. It's starting to scare me. John, I have to tell you something. What did you need to tell me? I think you're my soulmate, John. That's great, honey. But that means I can't grow old with you. Head and shoulders, knees and toes. I can't touch my toes. I can't read. <laughs> Timmy can't touch his toes. <laughs> <laughs> you must do whatever the song says or you die. Head and... Everyone pay attention. The head and shoulders song is playing. Shoulders spin around. Spin around. Oh no, I'm becoming so dizzy. Spin around. Oh no, I'm getting too dizzy. I can't do it. I can't spin anymore. I'm going to fall over. Eugene, you have to spin or she'll kill you. Can I spin on the floor? Eugene! Head and... Did you just get the head and shoulder song? You don't hear it? No, that means you're getting a personal instruction. Brianna, what rhymes with fool? What rhymes with fool? School! Correct! That was easy. Speaking of school, Emily, hurry up, we're gonna be late! I'm ready! Emily, what rhymes with orange? Orange? But nothing rhymes with orange! There's gotta be something that rhymes with orange. Storage, porridge. Emily, they have to be actual words. Sporange? No, Emily, that's not a word. Correct. I got it. Oh, awesome. Why aren't you girls at school yet? We're heading to school now, Mom. Mom, what rhymes with daughters? Daughters. That should be an easy word for you to rhyme. Right, Mom? I don't know. I can't think clearly today. I'm so tired. It's okay. You can do it. Just clear your head. Um... Daughters. Mom. I can't. Mom, please. <laughs> Mommy. My mother. Brianna. What rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. Brianna. What rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. <laughs> Mommy. Emily, stop crying. I'm trying to think. I want mommy. Mommy's gone, okay? She's gone and she's never coming back. Brother. Correct. <laughs> hey, Emily. I'm sorry I acted that way. I'll walk myself to school today. Don't follow me. Emily! Bree, you good? My mom couldn't rhyme the word this morning, and my sister won't even talk to me. So yeah, I'm not doing great. Brianna, what rhymes with sister? Miss her. Correct. Man, that's tough. Here, do my assignment for me. Brittany, what rhymes with assignment? Nothing rhymes with assignment because assignment isn't even a real word. Assignment is most definitely a real word. Assignment, hmm. Come on, Brittany, use your brain. I don't need to use my brain because I'm pretty. Brittany! Brianna, something happened to your sister. Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Your sister's school called. They said she never showed up to class. What? Do you know where she might be? Just give me a minute. I need to rhyme the word. Frost? Correct. I need to find my sister. I need to talk to you. Let me go. I need to find my sister. I want to get back together, babe. You cheated on me. Jake, what rhymes with cheated? 
You're not going anywhere. You're gonna help me rhyme this word. Hot, hot. When you're hot, you're... Um, warm, did it? That's not a good hint. Give me a better one. During our relationship, you blank me. I cheated on you? <laughs> you mistreated me. Emily? Emily, are you out here? I'm sorry I yelled at you. I love you. Sissy? Emily. I'm so glad you're here. I was so lost. Emily. What rhymes with love? First question about your soulmate. Answer 10 right and you get to meet him. Your soulmate prefers light or dark hair. Well, I have light hair, so he must prefer light hair, right? No? You know what? I could kind of pull up dark hair. Oh, who threw hair at me? It was Jimmy. Jimmy! Oh! Your soulmate believes in marriage or doesn't believe in marriage. Well, if he has the same values as me, he would believe in marriage. Your soulmate is quiet or loud? Hmm, let's go with quiet. Yes, I knew it! He's quiet just like me! Your soulmate is cold or warm? What does that even mean? Your soulmate is alive or dead? Wait, but if he's dead, how would I meet him? Would I die too? No way. He has to be alive. My soulmate's dead? Wait, that can't be good. After you answer 10 questions correctly, you meet your soulmate. But how would you meet him if he's dead? Would you die too? Would you be quiet, Jimmy? Your soulmate has light or dark hair. It's okay. All I have to do is answer all the questions wrong, and then I won't have to meet my soulmate. He probably has light hair like me, so I'll answer dark hair. No! Sports or sleep? He probably likes sports, right? So sleep. Mother! Fish or dog? Let's go fish. Apples or bananas? Water or soda? Texting or calling? That's it. I'm not answering any more questions. What's this timer above my head? It's timing you to answer the next question. If you stop answering questions, you'll die. Dancing or singing? Well, I like singing, so he must also like singing, so I'll choose dancing. No! Brianna, everything will be okay. No, Timmy, it's not going to be okay. I have one more question left, and if I answer it right, I'm going to be dead, just like my soulmate. What is it? What's the question? Your soulmate has met you before? Obviously, I've never met my soulmate, so... I'll choose yes? No. No, I've met my soulmate before, but when? When would I have met him? Ah! 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 Am I dead? Well, I'm at a graveyard. R.I.P. Timmy. <laughs> That's funny, I know a Timmy. Yeah, you do. It's me. Timmy, that can't be you. You're alive. You're right in front of me. I was allowed to appear in front of you and only you until you found out I'm your soulmate. But I'm not alive. I'm just a soul. Timmy, no! One, two, three... Four, somebody's knocking at your door. Who's there? Who are you? How did you know that? Five, six, seven, eight. Answering the door will be a mistake. <gasps> Sweetie, did you already finish studying? Yeah, Mom, I'm done studying. I'm just heading to bed, okay? Just keep that door locked! Brianna? Yes, sir? I need you to come see me after class. We need to talk about your grades. Okay, yeah. You asked to see me, sir? Your grades have been declining exponentially. One, two, three, four. Somebody's coming to the door. Somebody's coming to the door. Excuse me? I need to lock that door! One, two, three, four. Somebody's coming to the door. Somebody's coming to the door. Excuse me? I need to lock that door. What are you doing? Someone's trying to get in. I'm going to open the door. No, 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 you can't. You don't understand. I understand. Now move out of my way. Five, six, seven, eight. Push him through the door before it's too late. No, no, no. Let me in. Open the door. Let me in. Open the door. One, two, three. Three, four. It's safe now to go through the door. Brianna, have you seen our teacher, Mr. Stevens, anywhere? 
No, I haven't seen him anywhere. Huh, weird. One, two, three, four. Don't open the door. Don't open that door. Bro, but they're knocking. Grandma, I just got a word above my head. It said, mm. No, don't say the word. You have to act it out and I have to guess what the word is. I have three tries and if I guess them all wrong, I die. Okay. It's uh, very silly and it likes banana. Minions. No. squeaky door your grandfather still hasn't fixed no grandma it's an animal your little sister <laughs> no grandma it was a monkey emily hurry you're going to make us miss the bus okay sissy i'm ready emily i just got it acted out what am i eating air <laughs> no it's a candy you eat all the time mommy doesn't let me eat candy celery <laughs> no okay emily what is this Okay, Emily, what is this? Lollipop. Yes, you got it. Now, come on. We're going to miss the bus. Boo. Ah! What is wrong with you, Emily? Why would you scare me like that? I got an act it out. Oh. Sissy, watch this. Okay, so I put this over my head and I am a... A white sheet. No, it's a costume. People dress up as this on Halloween. A monster! So close. It's a white monster that floats and says boo. A ghost! You got it. It took you long enough. You're not very smart, sissy. Get over here, Emily! Mommy! You okay, babe? Yeah, babe, I'm all right. I had to run to school this morning. I missed the bus. I just got an acted out. Oh, uh, texting? No, oh, touchdown, score! Strike! What the f Touchdown, score, strike. What the? None of that makes any sense. Come on, babe. It's something you love. Men. <laughs> what? No. Beep, boop, pop, beep, beep, beep. You and your boys, when you hang out, you play a video game. <gasps> yes, baby. You got it. Thank goodness. Let's break up. What? I'm sorry, but it's not me. It's you. I don't have feelings for you anymore. Fine, goodbye forever then. Wait, I know this is kind of a bad time, but I got an act it out. Look at my hands, heart, heart. It represents the word. Heart, heartbreak? <clears throat> no, it's a feeling that I don't have for you anymore. Love? Yes. You're breaking up with me because you don't love me anymore? Yes, you got it. <sighs> Bestie, you're not going to believe what Brianna happened. Uh-oh, drama. I just got an act it out. Now, which one of you should I get to guess the word? I just got an acted out. Now, which one of you should I get to guess the word? Pick her! She's supposed to be your best friend, but she's been seeing me behind your back the whole time we've dated. You're right. Stephanie, guess the word. You're a really good friend, Stephanie. Are you acting it out right now? Best friends? <coughs> I forgive you for what you did. Uh, forgiveness? <coughs> I completely understand why you kissed my boyfriend, and I hope we can be friends forever! Oh, I hope we can still be friends, too. The answer is kindness. No. The word was liar. I was acting like a liar. Are you okay, Brianna? No, I'm not okay. My ex kissed my best friend, and then my best friend lost playing acted out, which is all my fault, and I feel terrible about it. I'm sorry to say this, but I just got an acted out. Timmy! Don't say my name in a mean voice. Don't play with me right now, Timmy. You don't play with me. Hurry up and act up the word. I am. Hi, I'm Brianna, and today I'm going to be making a candy salad with all my friends. I brought the Sour Patch. My name is Miss Applewood, and I brought the mint. No, Miss Applewood. You were supposed to bring a sweet candy, not a minty one. I gotta sneeze. No. Hey, I'm Timmy, and I brought the mamba. Hi, I'm Eugene, and I brought the nerves. Hi, my name is Brittany and I brought the sweet tarts because I am just so sweet. What's up everyone? I'm Jake and I brought the sour, chewy nerd. Bon appetit. Uh, I think I lost my dentures in there. I am fed up, okay? I quit. I am sick of slime, all right? I tried to make slime again. Wanna know how it went? Not good. Brianna, zero. Slime, two. Look, I spilled, first of all, I spilled glue all over my shirt. 
or slime or whatever all over my shirt, all over my pants. And then it still didn't even turn out well. I'll show you guys. Also, it's all over my floor. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's like better than last time, but it's so sticky. I don't know, man. Look, guys, I did it. This is what you wanted, right? Boys, do it. I feel these slime videos. This is what you want. This is what you want from me. <laughs> oh my goodness. I have so much to clean up. I went to with your mommy's purse. Chicken nugget. Brianna, did you steal my purse? No. I really hope you're telling the truth because if you don't tell the truth before the timer runs out, You'll die. Okay, I took it. I'm glad you told the truth. Now remember, never lie because it's very dangerous, okay? Okay. Brianna, has Jake came to school yet? Uh, my boyfriend Jake? No, I haven't seen him yet. Hey, baby. Jakey! Are we still on for our date tonight? Of course. <laughs> Jake, you are so funny. Aw, uh, it's just like you could get any girl in the world and you chose Brianna. <laughs> Um, anyways, I gotta go. I'll see you later, babe. Okay, bye, Jakey. Hey, Emma. Do you have a crush on my boyfriend? Because you were acting like a total pick-me when he was around. What? No way. Why would I like your boyfriend? Are you sure you're telling the truth? Honestly? What? No, why would I like your boyfriend? Are you sure you're telling the truth? Honestly, yeah, I do have a crush on Jake. But there's something else you should know. Jake and I were dating behind your back a few months ago. I'm sorry, Brianna. No, no, Emma, you're lying. He would never do that. If I was lying, I would die. Go ask Jake yourself if you don't believe me. Got your pen. Jakey. <laughs> Jake, Emma told me earlier that you guys used to date while dating me. Is that true? It's Brianna and Jake. Did you already finish your assignments? Yep. Yeah. Yes, sir. It's true. Emma and I were seeing each other while you and I were dating. But I don't love Emma. I've always loved you. I don't love you, and I never have, Jake. Brianna. I'm in love with Jake, and I always have been. Was that Jake? Brianna, what rhymes with fool? What rhymes with fool? School. Correct. That was easy. Speaking of school, Emily, hurry up. We're going to be late. I'm ready. Emily, what rhymes with orange? Orange, but nothing rhymes with orange. There's got to be something that rhymes with orange. Storage, porridge. Emily, they have to be actual words. Sporange? No, Emily, that's not a word. Correct. I got it. Oh, awesome. Why aren't you girls at school yet? We're heading to school now, Mom. Mom, what rhymes with daughters? Daughters. That should be an easy word for you to rhyme. Right, Mom? I don't know. I can't think clearly today. I'm so tired. It's okay. You can do it. Just clear your head. Um... Daughters. Mom. I can't. Mom, please. <laughs> Mommy. My mother. Brianna, what rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. Brianna, what rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. <laughs> Mommy. Emily, stop crying. I'm trying to think. I want mommy. Mommy's gone, okay? She's gone and she's never coming back. Brother. Correct. <laughs> hey, Emily, I'm sorry I acted that way. I'll walk myself to school today. Don't follow me. Emily! Bree, you good? My mom couldn't rhyme the word this morning, and my sister won't even talk to me. So yeah, I'm not doing great. Brianna, what rhymes with sister? Miss her. Correct. Man, that's tough. Here, do my assignment for me. Brittany, what rhymes with assignment? Nothing rhymes with assignment because assignment isn't even a real word. Assignment is most definitely a real word. Assignment? Hmm. Come on, Brittany, use your brain. I don't need to use my brain because I'm pretty. Pretty. Brianna, something happened to your sister. Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Your sister's school called. They said she never showed up to class. What? Do you know where she might be? Just give me a minute. I need to rhyme the word. Frost. Correct. I need to find my sister. I need to talk to you. Let me go, I need to find my sister. I wanna get back together, babe. You cheated on me. Jake, what rhymes with cheated? You're not going anywhere. You're gonna help me rhyme this word. Hot, hot, when you're hot, you were. Um, warm, did it? That's not a good hint, give me a better one. During our relationship, you blank me. I cheated on you? <laughs> you mistreated me. Emily, Emily, are you out here? I'm sorry I yelled at you. I love you. Sissy? Emily. I'm so glad you're here. I was so lost. 
Emily, what rhymes with love? Eyes that can see into the future or eyes that can see into the past? Hmm. Choose. I know no wanna. Choose. Here, Brianna, I have a cookie. What's in the cookie? Cookie. Mmm, yummy. Mmm, yummy. Brianna, are you okay? This cookie's dangerous. Oh! My cookie. You should be thanking me, Timmy. I just saved your life. I'm heading to work now. Bye, Mom. Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because something happened to your mother. She... Mom, don't go to work today. Why? I have to... Just please don't. Okay, I won't. Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because... Brianna, come play with me. Um, no thanks, Timmy. You are stinky. Uh... Brianna, you have to agree to whatever someone tells you to do, or else you bye-bye from Earth. Okay, Timmy, I'll play with you, but you're so smelly, so I'm going to hold my breath the whole time. Yay! Here's your test bag. <gasps> ah! I failed? Mr. Smith? What? Give me an A. Fine, I guess I have no choice. Hey, baby. Jakey, hey, babe. I'm sorry, but we're breaking up. Okay, yeah, sure. Hey, Jake. Yeah? Be my boyfriend again. Um, okay. Hey, Brianna, don't be my girlfriend. You can't override what I just asked you to do. You are my boyfriend. No. Yes, you are. No. You are my boyfriend. I don't want to be. You are. You have no choice. I'm in love with your mom. <laughs> Jakey? What happened to my boy? What did you do? My Jakey. Grandma, <coughs> are you feeling any better? No, darling. I'm very sick. My time's almost up. But there's one thing I need to give you before I go. Ooh, button. No. Don't push the button, whatever you do. But I want to push the button. It's fun. You just go, bleep. No. <coughs> you can't push the Grandma. button. Grandma. Grandma. Grandma, no. Why does she always carry around the button? Yeah, it's so weird. It's the last thing my grandma gave me before she passed away. It means a lot to me. Push it. I want to see what happens. I can't push it. She told me not to. Why? What happens if you push it? I don't know. Something. But it can't be good if I'm not allowed. Come on. Push the button. No. Push it. No, I can't push it. Push the button. No, I'm not pushing the button. Just do it. No. Come on. I'm not pushing push the it. button. Hmm. Nothing happened. <gasps> Mommy, it's almost the new year. Forget Mommy or Daddy. No, no, I can't choose. Sweetie, you have to choose before it's the new year, or else you'll forget us both. Five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year, Mom. Mommy, Happy New Year. Who are you, little girl? Why are you talking to me? I'm your daughter. I don't have a six-year-old. I only have one daughter, and she's 15 years old. Mommy. Oh, no, darling. I think your mother chose to forget you. Who are you? Get away from me, weirdo! That's it. I'm going to get milk. It's that time of year again, Mom. What time of year? Where we choose who we will forget in the new year. Oh, it's that time again? What are your first options? Remember when you chose to forget me when I was six? That was so long ago. You were six years old. We barely had any memories to begin with. But I know you now. I choose. I choose. What were your options? You never told me, sweetie. It was between older sister and grandma. I chose grandma. Good choice. Grandma's old anyways. Yeah. Girl, your fit is so cute. Thank you, bestie. Now, how does my girlfriend get more beautiful every single day? Stop it, babe. What's wrong, Bree? I just got my next set of options. No, no, I'm not going to choose. Brianna, you have to choose because if you don't choose before it gives you the next set of options, you'll forget them both. Who in the new year are you going to forget? It was between Timmy or Jimmy. I chose Jimmy. That's a good choice. Everyone likes Timmy better. I wish my girlfriend was as pretty as you. So leave her and be with me. Don't worry, I will soon. I made the wrong choice. I'm not going to choose. I want to forget them both. Oh, babe, you're here. I'm not your babe. Not anymore. Got your pen. Jimmy. Jimmy, catch. Jimmy. Catch, Jimmy. Come on, guys. Get 
Give me my pen back. Forget Timmy or Jimmy. Hmm. Choose Jimmy. What? No, don't choose me. Timmy's the one who stole your pen in the first place. I'm going to choose Jimmy. Jimmy! I thought you said you got them as an option earlier, Brianna. Why'd you lie to me? Uh, you know what? Don't even tell me. Bestie, wait! Sophie, let me explain. Why didn't you tell me who you actually chose to forget? I didn't tell you because... I chose to forget you over my boyfriend. Oh, I just got an option. Choose to forget you or choose to forget Emma. I choose. I choose. Bessie, please don't choose to forget me. And why not? You chose to forget me. I know when it was a mistake, but you and Emma aren't even that close. If you choose to forget me, then neither of us will ever remember our memories together. And we won't ever meet again. Why would I want to remember someone who chose a boy over their best friend? <laughs> Emma would never do what you did. Goodbye, Brianna. It's one more day till the new year. Almost everyone I care about is going to be forgotten. Forget my cat Oreo or my older sister? No, no, I can't choose. No, I have to choose. I don't want to forget them both. It disappeared. I'm going to forget both of them? 15 seconds until the new year. New year, new me. Forget myself or everyone I've ever known? Brianna, it's almost a new year. Hurry and choose. Jimmy. Hey, Timmy. Let's play dollies. No, I don't want to. Ow! Shh. Timmy, don't yell. Timmy, no. Boo. Don't scare me like that. Are you trying to kill me? Relax. I was just joking. Well, it's not funny. Hey, Brianna, have you seen my boyfriend Derek anywhere? I haven't seen him all day. No, sorry, I haven't. Help! Help! Someone help! They're after me! They're chasing me! No! Derek, my baby! I'm scared. Who was after Derek? I think there's someone in the building. No one panic. Hello, Brianna. Timmy, I thought you were dead. I came back to haunt you. I came back. To haunt you. Come on, scream. Come join me, Brianna. Join hey, me, Brianna. Brianna, are you seeing scary images? I am. It's not real. Cover your eyes and come with me. What you saw before wasn't real. They're trying to scare us, so we scream. You may see images or people that aren't really there. It's all because they want to eliminate... Oh, no. Your face. It's... It's... I'm sorry. I have to go. Jake, wait. Do I really look that bad? Jake, why did you run away from me? Stay away from me. Stay away from me. Your face, it's scary. Does he really think I'm that ugly? Hi, sweetie. Mom, what are you doing here? Who's at home watching Emily? I wanted to see you. Who are you talking to? My mom. There's no one there. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you talking to? My mom. There's no one there. <laughs> are you okay sweetie you are look you frightened okay, sweetie? You're, you're not my real mom you're just here to scare me so i scream look at me i'm your mom you're not real i'm real you're not real stop it stop it stop it you're not real <laughs> how could you Look what you did to your mom. What? You're a bad daughter. You're a bad... No. That was your real mom. You're not real. She's gone because of you. You're not real. Come on, mom. Pick up the phone. Sissy, there you are. Sissy, what are you doing here? Mommy disappeared, so I went looking for you. It's okay. Hold my hand. You're holding it so tight, sissy. You know what happened to mommy. You're not sissy. Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Here, you should take your umbrella. It's raining cats and dogs outside. Come on, Mom. It can't be that bad. On second thought, I'll take that umbrella. For the class project, you'll be partnered with Steve. Who's Steve? I never met him. We've literally been in the same class for years. Hi, Steve. Meeting someone for the first time can be awkward. Do you mind if I break the ice? Go ahead. Great.
What did you get on the test, Brianna? An A, obviously. <laughs> liar, liar, pants on fire. Ah! Ah, my pants! My pants on fire! My pants on fire! How much for this granola bar? They're not cheap. It will cost you an arm and a leg. Are you serious right now? That's so expensive. Don't blame me. Blame inflation. It's just an arm, okay? All right. I guess that's fine. Oh, no. It's a serial killer. Ah! Guys, relax. It's just cereal. Ah! Hey, Brianna. Are you ready for the test today? No, I didn't study. Then you really should hit the books. Yeah. <laughs> You may begin writing your test. Stephanie, I'm really worried about this test. Don't worry, Bree. It's a piece of cake. Oh, it's a piece of cake. <laughs> Stephanie, you're not going to believe what I just found out about Timmy. Come on, spill the tea. There was no tea wasted in the making of this video. Brianna, you told Stephanie my secret? Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to lose your marbles. And you lost your marbles, Timmy. Here's your test back. <gasps> I got a 70%. I got 100 Careful, you're turning green with envy. I'm not envious. You're green. Ah! Mm, uh... Honey. Oopsies. Uh-oh, you got a mark. Five mistakes and you're out. Out? Like... Yes, exactly. Two plus two. Brianna, what's the answer? Um... I can't answer it. I don't want to make a mistake. I know the answer. It's three. That was Timmy's fifth mistake. Five mistakes and you're out. Brianna, hold this. What is wrong with you? Why did you give that to me to hold when I wasn't ready? Chill out, it's no big deal. No, I can't chill out. I have two marks now. Three more and I'm out. Giving her that to hold was a mistake. What, how is that a mistake? Was it a mistake? Brianna, if you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Was it a mistake? Brianna? If you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Um, no, that's my last mistake. You still have three left. It was her mistake, not mine. Hey, guys. You can't sit with us. Why not? The reason Sophie's dead. You let her die so you didn't get another mark. Why should I get a mark? I wasn't the one who made a mistake. Five marks, and you're out. You're so selfish. Your shoelaces are untied. Hmm? Why would you do that? Sir, she made a mistake. She forgot to tie her shoelaces, and then she tripped. What? No, you tripped me. You're now the school's target. That's what you get for killing Sophie. You're going to be next. <laughs>